What else you two niggas agree with? <laughs> I think I think Rory, you like the industry more than Joe though. Thank th- Yo, this po- hold up, man. Turn this record off. Turn this goddamn this podcast is going to the next level. I'm telling you, these last few weeks we've been on a roll. We've been on a roll these last few weeks. I've been really liking the vibe. And Maul, I really gotta give it to you, man. You've been stepping out of your comfort zone. <laughs> Like, I never thought I'd see the day where we are starting with the psychological take from Maul <laughs> on his calls. I deep, agree. Deep dive. Four Rory, minutes in. you love this label shit, goddammit. Hold up. Let me get a gunshot for Rory loving the label shit. Uh, if, I, if, if I did, why would I have left? Because you have your own platform now. Yeah, but I, if I loved it, I still could have done it. Mm, just all the things you love that you leave. <laughs> Sometimes you gotta leave I before still, leave I you. still disagree Because uh, every platform You can't be buddy buddy With Hove Preaching all of this ownership And then work for the label While you're owning things <laughs> I don't understand what uh, do, do the science no. I, I will say Out of the three no, platforms That Joe has had After his retirement He's brought them all To conglomerates That are within the industry I myself have left In that process You mean licensing I don't need to explain that to you, right? No. First of all, Complex no. was not no. licensed. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. You still get a check for everyday struggle? No Where's my drop? No <laughs> Complex? Where's, where's my drop at? No Complex was licensing? Oh, that wasn't part of my last three. I've been on a tremendous run. <laughs> <laughs> I've been on a tremendous run. No, Complex was one of my earlier endeavors. That's y'all here. Here, That's what it was? Here. Yo, live. Charity. The charity of Joe Budden. Live. Live. Yo, act. Wayne, come love Wayne on, nigga. <laughs> Come love Wayno. I love Wayno. Me too. That's my dude. Then live, <laughs> right? Live life. See, that's the problem right now in humanity. Live died. Live and on the strength, like when niggas meant it. Now live is still on Sundays in Miami. Is that still a thing? Hmm. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, I don't think I, I like the industry as much as you guys paint me. To do. I don't so. paint you to like the industry. I just think you like it more than Joe. I think I love music, and Can you sometimes end? you have to compromise within your Maul, loves to make right, a living. Done listening to Rory's bullshit. Maul, explain to me a little more why you feel like that about Rory. I think you're dead on right now. Um, I think because Rory worked in the industry for so many years, he knows the ropes. He knows how to maneuver. He has relationships. Um, but he's he's been able to create a platform of his own and a name for him, for himself. You but he still has never to just insult somebody. It has to <laughs> no, it's not an insult. Why, why does it end? In, but he created his own way. Yeah, but he, he still, but he still maneuvers. He maneuvers differently through the industry now. Though. All right, whatever, man. I don't care. No, yeah. If y'all gonna be serious, then fuck it. <laughs> uh, yeah, boy, you fucked that was a great. Uh, you so pussy, man. We got a uh, character development. We will get to it. Character. <laughs> character. I'm not, it's not a character. Character it's me. Oh, That's why oh my God. Industry. Look yeah. how through he's trying to change you. Character development. Yeah. <laughs> what? Trying yeah, to make you something I, you're not to I, sell artist records. development. <laughs> I just want to say that what record we was talking about? Oh, we was talking about uh, my type. My type. The, what's that? The uh, the uh, City Girls record. Sweetie. Sweetie. I mean, no, uh, sweetie. Uh, uh, the Sweetie record. Yeah. And I asked these gentlemen what they do in the, in the spot when that record comes on because <laughs> I, I wanted to know what niggas did. Cause that's my shit. <laughs> You gotta, you gotta, you, if you're not a, I re- I, I'm not a dancer I, I requested it I just want to hear it though I give him an aggressive head nod <laughs> gotta hold your drink tight cause you, you'll give, start getting bumped I give him something a little more aggressive okay uh, and then Rory was like nah fuck that that's my jam I'm, I'm turning it I'm turning it up yeah, turning it out when that's my shit on. right there you get your shoulders involved of course feet moving <laughs> other vibrations recognized when Hell that comes yeah. on nah, I might I made a paper towel after that okay. and you know Rory <laughs> loves labels so rich niggas is his type <laughs> That's disgusting. <laughs> That's disgusting. Rory do like rich niggas. That's disgusting. Uh, you know what? You, you love Puff. You're not so waiting on every. We're in the same boat. You're not waiting on every Ross album. Of course I am. Nasty. See, <laughs> look, 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 just That's nasty because you wait for. Yes. I'm waiting for it, so I'm nasty oh, too. You're waiting man. on rich niggas. Yeah, I'm waiting. For it. Yeah. Fuck it, man. I'm, I'm waiting for. I'm waiting for yeah. good album. All right, oh, you nasty. <laughs> Fuck it. Why are you waiting on rich niggas? I'm waiting they for rich. no. I'm waiting for a Ross album. Damn, not, no, I'm not no, waiting no, for but him. Do, but do the science on no, it. No, I'm not doing the science. <laughs> it's crazy. I'm, I'm gonna give him money too. <laughs> Come on, you know. oh my god, man. I'm gonna buy it. <laughs> I'm not starting like this. We well, are. No, I'm not. Uh, actually, yeah, no, I'm not. Uh, I'm playing another record. God damn it. <laughs> what record you playing? Uh, I was in a car one day with some women from Brooklyn, like some Neo Soul, the chicks that Rory always talks about. Oh, you got to yeah. play music. They're so awesome. But I was, Great women. No, but I, I had the aux, and I was in the middle of one of my real good sets, real good sets. And then and then one of the women 
kept asking for the aux, and I don't normally know Brooklyn Neil Soul chicks to be annoying like that. No, they're usually not. Nah, they normally let you rock. They'll, they'll, you, nah, you they'll give you. Them. They'll give you like two or three records. They'll give you a chance, and if you fumble, they're yeah, gonna say something. Yeah, but I was on fire on the aux. I agree. I've but heard this, your sets. But this girl was persistent. I've heard your sets. This girl was <laughs> nah, persistent. When Joe getting his Neil Soul bag with women around. Nah, I fuck, with, I fuck with my guy. Rory, see, but this is this is the problem with this podcast. If anybody knows that to be true, it's Maul. I didn't, Maul hasn't said anything. You haven't argued in my case? I'm not, it's not an argument. I'm just listening. I'm listening to what y'all saying. But you know I'm that, trying to get the picture y'all about to paint. Well, anyway, so this woman was being very persistent, which was really annoying. So eventually I did get, uh, let her play a song. So okay. Song. And now it's my favorite song in the world. <laughs> what song was this? I'm just going to play this it. my type. I, I, <laughs> I really went left with that one. <laughs> I'm gonna, it just, it, but listen, it, it just, it's just a feel-good record. It just feels good. If okay. it's a nice day out and it feels good, I think the vocals are like mixed horribly, but that's part of why it's so great. Ah, like, uh, one of those. It's, it's like, now nah, we did it, it on purpose. Adds to it. Yeah. Just, listen, man. Let me, let me play this. Parks, part. cover your ears. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Park, Parks going to feel the way, right? Oh I no! Like yep. It's mixed bad sometimes. I'm letting this whole shit rock. And when this come on at the pool party, oh look out! <laughs> oh yeah, I played a sleeper. Not this one. Ooh, they got no, the but off this project. Yeah, they got the little record scratch. This, this record's a little different. Well, no, this whole project is great. Ball didn't go to Curl Fest? He, he, mm, which is craziness. <laughs> That's crazy. That's crazy. And, and we're starting with that, too. I cannot believe. <laughs> you know what I don't like about Maul? And he told me he was meeting me. At Curl Fest. Yeah. Wow. And you would expect someone would meet you at Curl at Fest. Curl, that's... And, and, and Maul, Maul's hair is curly. That is true. That's true. And Randall's Island's right next to the Bronx. Come yeah. on, Maul. Mad easy to get to. It might like, technically be the Bronx. I'm not sure. Yeah, like, it Maul, might be. Yeah, Maul, yeah where is that? That was my first time. Just, just Randall's Island. Island. Yeah. I've never gone that way. <laughs> like that exit. Yeah, every time. Yeah, like, oh, oh yeah. try, bro. But yet I knew how to get there by muscle memory. Not right. even yeah. not even GPS. You never did Rock the Bells there? No. No, nah, okay. I was at the one. I used, I used to run that. track there. They have a big Fire, track Fire Island, is that what it was? Governor's that Island. That was Governor's Island. Yeah. They did Randall's. I think they did too. At one but, point. Yeah. This doesn't matter. I was done by then. <laughs> 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 Wu Tang made sure we never got on another. <laughs> <part. laughs> Meanwhile, they did about seven after that. <laughs> well, I didn't know Wu Tang like kind of owned that shit. I think they were definitely there in the beginning. I think Nas was the owner of that shit too. Well, you don't want to fight with anybody that's owning it. <laughs> or think you probably not a good idea. You don't want to fight with them anyway. Yeah, I mean, because you're not label man. <laughs> I'm label man. I fight with all the labels. <laughs> you niggas is crazy, man. So I go. All right, I don't know what the weather is, but I'm here to have a good time. I'm happy to see you gentlemen today for some reason. Some of these Wednesday, Wednesday podcasts, it feels like I haven't seen you guys in eons. 
Yeah, Raw three days. R and B was out though. Hey, hey R and B hit streets. the streets. Uh, keep tradition alive. Yeah, I saw y'all. I saw y'all. Yeah, they, they, they had to feel the energy out there. The streets yeah. was asking, man. When the streets ask, you got to give them what they want. Mm. No, nah, but we can't wait. We went out Friday night. We linked. Oh, we did. Yo, yeah, fam, see, I don't. All right, let me see. Turn we this linked off, Friday. Please. Don't do that, Joe. Don't do that. <laughs> we linked Friday. All right. All right. Hold up. That don't count. Y'all niggas is really annoying. With <laughs> no, 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 Microphone check, one, two, what is this? Welcome to episode 267 of the Joe Budden Podcast. I'm your humble, gracious, and grateful host, Joe Budden, here with a few of my nearest and dearest friends. Maul is here, Parks is here, Rory is here, Erickson is here, and Savon is here. I want to say what's up to our Spotify listenership. I want to say salute to, oh yeah, we got, so, oh, I forgot we bought a camera. Ooh, we fancy. <laughs> Uh, I want to say what up to our Spotify <laughs> listenership. I want to shout out our YouTube viewership. I want to shout out all of our day ones and our last days. Everybody listening for the first time and the last time. Uh, and everybody just keeping it cool, man. <laughs> yeah, shout out to people keeping it cool. Ever since I get attacked from from trying to have like really specific uh, shout outs, I just try to keep it really vague. With <laughs> okay. Shout out to everybody just keeping it cool. Yeah. Uh, shout out to the vendors at festivals that have great food. Ooh, the food truck people. Important, yeah. Important. yeah. Food truck people in general, actually, very much important. Unsung yeah. heroes, right there. They are. Somebody told me I should think about having food trucks uh, for the pool party. It's not a bad idea. It's not a bad idea. A little taco you truck. So? Yeah. I mean, it. it I would sad. try to keep people off the off the off street because that'll cause neighbors to call the cops. I, yeah. I wouldn't want a food truck. But he's got that big ass driveway. You could put. A food oh yeah, that's true. There. Could put that at the bottom. Yeah. Oh, that's kind of swag. That's actually great. Get a food truck and ice cream truck. I take back everything I said. Yeah, wow. yeah. food truck. Yeah, damn, that might be a good idea now. When we bring yeah. my ice cream truck. <laughs> Set that shit off. Boy, yeah, Ball's gonna sell weed out of the Wait, ice cream I was about truck. To say the, the, <laughs> Rory, Rory, goddamn, <laughs> put me in the handcuffs. Wait. Put me in the cuffs, Rory. <laughs> Lock me up. Throw away the key. Well, that's nah, what the labels fucking... are doing. That's true. <laughs> that's true. That's what the labels that's are true. doing. Ah, that's so more. Ah, so more. Tell us on. about the first brick that you ever possessed <laughs> in my DJ Vlad voice. <laughs> yeah, look at Maul, look. tell us about the first shooting. Look at Vlad. <laughs> the first victim. <laughs> 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 First victim, Rolad. 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 So tell us about the crimes you got away with. <laughs> Where's the weapon? <laughs> All right, listen, man. Enough of your shenanigans. <laughs> Y'all shenanigans. And weed is uh, legal in New Jersey, Maul. I would never do that to you. Aha. Uh-huh. <laughs> Maul lives in Westchester, I thought. <laughs> Not yet. Mm. Mm. <laughs> That's my Whoa. first October. <laughs> October 2019. Um, all right, listen, man. How, how are you gentlemen feeling? What's going on? What's going great, on? Talk great. to me. Talk to me. Good weather. Good uh, weather. Oh yeah, that's what I was starting to say to you. Uh, I need. I just need definitions of what words mean. That shit. That shit that we did on Friday. I don't really consider that the the link, even though I oh. saw you guys. We said we were going to link after we recorded, and we did. That ain't the link. Though. That sounds like a link. The that's link. a link. We actually, we okually okay. said we was going to link, then right, we did. Because you separated, and then you yeah, yeah, linked. linked back up. All right, so what I'm saying is then we need the different terminologies for the different degrees of linking. Link. We, um, sometimes we link, and it's a blast. Sometimes we link, and it's not a blast. Okay. Mm. So is that still a link? Because link implies we had a pretty good time. Well, hold on. What's the I percentage of I normally link with, with you guys somewhere, so you link and I have getting... a horrible time there. <laughs> <laughs> and then I leave And y'all say Yeah we linked And I'm like Yeah but uh, You know yeah, yeah, still, linked, No no we have to, well, Let's find the percentage That's three of us right That's 33.3% mm. I had a great All time right, Foxy Brown <laughs> <laughs> I had a great time So that's my 33.3% Maul did you have a good time I had a good time That puts us at 60 Whatever This 67. is exactly how I left Slaughterhouse <laughs> exactly this, what's this happening. Math? Exactly what's happening right so, here. This math. I that vote means- yes for that song. All right, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I don't give a fuck if Rory had a good time. No do I can't more had a good time. I'm, sorry, I'm, I'm trying time. to figure out what a link is. And if 67% of the group had a good time, that's a link. Yeah, then you should look internally, Joe. You're going through something, you're fighting something, you're battling something. I look, in, <laughs> I look internally every day because every day I'm going through something okay. and battling something and fighting something. Yeah. You don't have to fight at the link, though. 
Uh, Leave your troubles outside. I think you and Rory know a few reasons why. I should have. <laughs> <laughs> so, and that's why. That's we, why anyway, you didn't have a good time we, at the so, league. So, so we like, linked. Yeah, yeah. But no, like, we why linked. Are you, what are you? <laughs> fucking, what you go away. Why though? Edit point, right, why? I'm not in point. Uh, why? why? I'm not in that. And that now edit point label. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to save you. That don't save me. I'm doing it. Uh, listen, man. Let's start this podcast. Okay. Uh, what do you What do y'all want to start with? It's a great question. I thought we were going to get into curl fest. And then, yeah. then we changed. Oh, yeah. Directions. Yeah, yeah. That yeah. was Friday. We linked. Whatever. Fri- Friday. That was such an unsuccessful link. I was so disappointed. Damn. With the link. So Damn. I just. Oh no! But you know what me and Maul do? You know what Maul talked about? You know why Maul is funny sometimes? Okay. Maul gave me like in the club, or maybe it was after club. I don't remember. But he gave me like a PowerPoint presentation on, or we had a whole conversation about just FaceTime dates. Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, okay. It's a weird place to have that. Yeah. Sometimes you got to go because you got a FaceTime date. Oh, because all right, yeah. Never mind. It's coming back to me now. Yeah. I caught the tail end of this conversation. That's what happened. So you left because you had a FaceTime date. Uh. FaceTime dates don't get enough credit. Let me just put that I'm out there. I'm starting with round of applause. Let me and, put uh, that. It could, FaceTime dates. Uh, it could be platonic. It could be I'm, a platonic I'm, I'm, FaceTime yeah, date. Yeah, just, sure. just, just a FaceTime date like, yo, 20 minutes, call me. That's kind of dope. I like that. Fam, they're really good. Yeah. So sometimes you have to assess your surroundings. Mm-hmm. I was standing in a corner. I was watching fucking 19-year-olds try to sing uh, Forever My Lady. <laughs> 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 they get younger and Yo, younger every time. Joe, Joe. Joe swears <laughs> these people to that are like four years younger than him <laughs> are in their teens. <laughs> That's what Joe does. Well, why do they dress like teens? I mean, you got the dad because they're trending. You're kind of <laughs> just yeah, letting I mean, you know, man. You are dressing a bit younger. <laughs> like dad doesn't imply old. It's funny. That, That's just the style. It's funny that just a dad hat says. You look younger, or you're trying to look. Nothing else has changed about me. If I, I wear this same thing with a black fedora, mm-hmm. no, yeah. it would change. Yeah, yeah some, something about just showing this top area of your head just makes you look younger for some reason. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Yeah, it's, it's we good, don't make though. the rules. It's good for you. Anyway, I thought I might have a better time rushing home and cuddling up with the phone in the bed. Did okay. not. <laughs> sometimes, it, sometimes that is the this better Friday option. just did not go your way. No, yes, it did. <laughs> no, he had, oh, you he did a, have a bad well, time. I thought you said it was bad. Oh, yeah. shit. No, I had an amazing time. Oh, okay. At right. home. That's what we're talking about. <laughs> yeah. Now. yeah. Yeah. Away from you fucking heathens. <laughs> I was not a heathen. <laughs> so then Saturday, we went where? You went to Curl Fest. Y'all right? went to Curl Fest. You went to Curl Fest. I did not go. Hit. Oh, oh Rory didn't go. You went to Curl I Fest. I hit Mall. I hit Mall because it was a black event. Didn't want to show up with my white friends. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you want to drink your fried curl That's fest there? Yeah, yeah. I don't know if Rory and Parks is all natural. My girl mm-hmm. really wanted to go. And if I mean, are, I, first of all, I was going to curl fest when it was way. underground. <laughs> I was going was in Prospect Park. Like y'all mm-hmm. are now because it's mainstream. Uh, uh, yeah, That's the, that industry shit. Yeah, but I was, I was, fuck, I was fucking with them when nah, it was underground. That's true. The labels been new about it. <laughs> you know, the labels we were silent to, partners. They get to drop on things. So I got wind of something called curl fest, only because Brandon was supposed to be speaking on a panel. Mm-hmm. Uh, at Curl Fest He does not have curls He doesn't have curls at all No And you know what I had heard of Curl Fest too But I'll be honest I, n- I never I never thought it was for guys Yeah I did too Yeah my girl wanted to go But it was sold out or something She was yeah, telling me all about it The first time I went I thought to myself Am I being the creepy guy yes. That's showing up to the thing I shouldn't be showing up yes. to Like am I look like that dude <laughs> Yes And yeah. I got there It wasn't that type of vibe That's what I used to say When I showed, showed up at BB's <laughs> <laughs> Like why is he in BB? <laughs> you know why I'm here. You know why I'm here. You know exactly why I'm here. I'm here because why are you here? <laughs> I'm just being the same I'm spot here. for the same reasons. I'm here. Yo, what you, you doing know, here? Why are you here? <laughs> you know that acknowledgement when you see you in a place maybe you shouldn't be. You see another dude you know. You just give him. Yeah. yeah. Same lineage. You don't you gotta say shit. You know the vibes. <laughs> just, same vibrations. Oh, all right. You here for the same thing? Um. So thirty thousand people. What we're talking about is Curl Fest. Uh, this is an event for all all natural women. Uh, this this year it was on Randall's Island. Normally it's in Prospect Park, uh, but they've gotten so much attention and coverage and press, and it, rightfully it, so, it's just blown up throughout throughout the last few years. And they needed more space, mm-hmm. so they sold thirty thousand tickets. I want to say, wow. which is a lot of tickets. I'm talking about just a sea of beautiful black people, man. It was like I, I I was disappointed that 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 we didn't plan better around that. Yeah, I was too. I would have liked us us all Fam, to have gone to. That. I would have loved to pod there. Yeah, <laughs> we could have set up shop. We should have potted. 
Mm-hmm. I agree. Yeah, we should have these conversations like pre-event. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't hip to it <laughs> until the day of. I really thought it was like a really just for women. But they had a bunch of uh, bunch of vendors there, a bunch of food trucks there. They had a uh, they had a stage, music, DJ, a lot of uh, a lot of celebrities. Uh, uh, they had another stage that was set up more for panels and conversation. Uh, a lot of con- a lot of good conversations over there. I caught a lot of that. Uh, I just want to congratulate uh, congratulate the founders and co founders of of the event. It was it's beautiful. And that's why today is beautiful in America, because you can start something and it'll just and you can get traction in it and watch it grow and develop rather quickly. Mm-hmm. Like they did this over the course of what, five, six years? Yeah, it hasn't been around that long. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. So uh, let me hit the round of applause for Salute the Curl Fest. Yeah, 100 percent. We would we would we get an invite next year. Oh, I'm going next year. <laughs> we yeah. headlining. I've yeah. seen a lot oh, of yeah. nice, nice videos on Instagram. Yeah, because I'm going to have curls next year. <laughs> sure. Get implants. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm Damn, I, do I have to rethink? Because I was gonna get like the new Tory Lanez joint, like right above my eyebrow, mm-hmm. the new hairline. Maybe I should re- rethink. Go, go this for the curls and just <laughs> just go for the curls, bro. <laughs> what, 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 what like some ju- carrot top type ter- curls? Yeah, there you go. What, carrot what, curls. Uh, uh, enough of this. What would you gentlemen like to start with? Uh, carrot enough. curls. No, we're not starting with carrot curls. Oh. What topic carrot would you gentlemen curls. like to start with? <laughs> okay, let's keep it on women. Let's keep it on women. Let's start with Nikki and Meg. Nikki, no, Nikki. Nikki and Meg the Stallions Insta Live interview session, right? Conversation. Yeah, it's yeah. a FaceTime date. <clears throat> they had a FaceTime date. Yeah. They had yeah. a face. A public FaceTime so, date. Don't worry, Nikki's not adding herself into the war of you, Elliot, and Charlemagne to talk to people. Sure, mm-hmm. sure. That's you're, exactly you're, what she's you're doing. You're safe. That is exactly what she's doing. <laughs> Queen, Queen Radio label exists. Label man. <laughs> Look at Label Man. No, nah, that's not the platform of that radio station right now. It's all Nikki. What? Her she's not queen radio? People, I guess, yeah. she, talks, she talks to her DJ. That's not true. She, she, she'll she, call she, someone she every plenty, now and then. She brings plenty of people in there. <laughs> I think she's starting to bring people in She brings now. plenty of people in there. Why, why, I think why, she had Fendi on the why last Why are you one? saying that? <laughs> Everything I've heard has been a few calls that lasted well, five minutes. A, you're not a barb or you're not an <laughs> avid listener. So, I mean, let's, let's say when we don't know. <laughs> That's not true. I catch it when I can. Which means you don't know. She has people on there. But anyway, we don't need to stop there. Uh, what do we need to take from this? I didn't watch this. Me either. I missed it. But I, I think I've seen a few clips. I think it's dope. I think, uh, I think it's good to see, you know, that there is no tension between uh, the legend Nikki and the rising star in uh in in Meg. I like I think Who they are put you people. <laughs> me. I never even heard you say rising star before. So she, she's a rising star. <laughs> I've lived with you for twenty She's years. not a star, she's a rising star. I know. I'm just saying I live with you for a long time and I've never heard you say Well I had to call it with shit. She's a rising star. She's right. making a lot of noise. She's uh she seems to have so she's making a lot of noise. <laughs> she Jesus. is I don't know why we're looking at me. <laughs> what, yeah. what you want me this to say? Nuts. Yeah, I gotta start. You were in more Rockefeller meetings than you let on. No. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I it don't is. Know. She is making a lot of noise though. All right, go ahead. She's continue. making a lot of noise. She has good records out. And it was just good to see them two having a conversation. Noisy and, where Meg is at. <laughs> it is. She's making a lot of noise. And it was just good to see them having a conversation <laughs> and it wasn't no it wasn't no uh no tension and no egos. And it seemed like that wasn't the first time they had a conversation. From what I from what I, I could tell. Well, I was gonna say, how, how far in advance do, you, do we think this was planned? Was this an in the moment uh, thing? I don't know. A, uh, but I'm, I'm sure it was planned. Probably the day of, a few minutes or a few hours earlier. But they seem like they have some type of rapport with each other. They seem like they speak. It didn't okay. seem like this was their first interaction their with each first other. First rodeo. Yeah, it didn't seem. Ah, like uh, I get it. Cause Houston. And, and she does. She wears the cowboy on, hat. Man. Come on, man. Why did he retire? <laughs> <laughs> no, answer me, niggas. So why did you retire? Why? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Hell, I don't know why you retired. We're not talk, here to talk about me. Anyway, back to oh. back to Meg and uh, back to Meg and Nick. No, I thought it was cool, man. Right, so I, I, I think this was definitely planned. I know you guys won't say it, and I don't think it's bad that it was planned. Wait, but can, can any of y'all ever include me in, when you say that? I know you guys won't say it. <laughs> Hey, I hate Rory, man. You industry. Yeah. I know you guys won't say it. Well, because, I'm the guy that says it. But you and Nikki, <laughs> you and Nikki text often. I know you guys are really close, and you guys are friends, like through Kaiser or something. So I, I know you're not gonna say it. We haven't texted in quite a while. Okay. Well, of course friends I think through Kaiser. <laughs> There's a little shot. I, by little the low. way, I don't even know if Kaiser know Nikki. <laughs> yeah, what, is, what would their affiliation be? <laughs> you. 
Nikki would hate Kaiser because <laughs> Kaiser is with Cardi. Uh. Mm. Clear, Damn, you, clear bro, you there, like a double Joe, clear it up. Let them know. You Let them know where the relationship sides. stem. <laughs> give them give them the stems. <laughs> Joe's got the stems. the stems. Joe's got the stems. <laughs> give them the stems, Let Joe. Let mix it, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> Give them the stems. Let them know. Nah, Yo, guys. Every, every time I'm Behind so Behind the scenes, close button. To getting us to being cohesive, it's like y'all can sense it and just band together to yeah. fuck it all, yeah. all up. Cohesion, is, right. cohesion sucks. I'm telling you, it works sometimes. It sucks. All right. That, that, those are the stems. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, you were saying, Rory. Come on. No, I, we won't I think, say it, so you say it. I think this is a, a good way, and I'm not saying <laughs> Nikki doesn't Parks. really like. Parks, let him say it. Go ahead. You won't. I, you guys won't. You're too. You're all too I, affiliated I, 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 with. I won't say it. <laughs> well, Maul, you haven't been saying anything about Nicki Minaj for about at least four years of the show. Now. What do you mean? I've, I've always I've I said, said nothing. Exactly. I've said everything I mean. about Nicki. <laughs> y'all, y'all was y'all, I hate when y'all, y'all was that. mad that y'all was mad that I was supporting Nicki. No. No. What? I support Nicki. Yeah, That's don't, not true. don't do that, fam. Do I've that. done man. I've done remixes. What? You didn't hear my Ganja Burn remix? No. <laughs> you heard you were you sitting next to me. You was in the studio. I wasn't there. <laughs> you was in the studio with me yeah, for the there. creation of that greatness. No. You was actually oh. a background singer. Yeah. You ain't oh, so artist. Oh, wait, so yeah. I got to give it to him. Like, wait, no, the streets no, 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 asked no, no. for it again? No, the street, nobody asked <laughs> for it. Wait, oh, wait are you going to release? Is this yeah. the mastered? <laughs> Re- the remastered edition? Yeah. <laughs> Engineers are going to find a way to sneak up in there. Remastered, refinished, re. Shut up. Why you ain't doing this the first time? That's the label. Not the engineers. I know, I know. I'm talking <laughs> shit. Um, <laughs> All right, well, it's yeah. the labels going to the engineers saying, hey, make it different. <laughs> no, no, or, or just turn it up hey, a little bit. Turn yeah. up the highs. <laughs> Word. That's all they do. put a little EQ on it, call it a day. Yeah. Hey, add, add some subs. Turn yeah. up the tambourine. That is, <laughs> well, this that sound, is all that turned up it? on a rematch. That's all it ever is. Will this sound turn better in AirPods? Yeah, just do it that way. All right, back to cohesion. <laughs> okay. Um, I think this is a way. And I'm not saying she doesn't like Megan, and this wasn't something she really wanted to do, but I think it's a way for Nikki to get back in the light of getting along with female rappers. I think she's been, with the whole Cardi situation, she's, her perception, not but who she is, has looked like a hater through the whole thing, and this is her way to support. See, this is where I talk about Nikki, because that to me, that was my argument from the beginning. I felt like people were trying to create tension between her and Cardi. I agree. And Nikki has from day one, she's always showed love to female MCs before her, female MCs that were current. Like, I feel like people pitted them I'm talk- together. I'm talking like, about the perception. People, but I don't even think that's the perception because if you look at Nikki Clips, she's always big well, enough female. I'm talking MCs. about perception, people, no matter about facts. People didn't make that girl throw a shoe with that girl. People didn't make that, that girl but that was, do a that whole was, bunch of shit. But that, don't do that. that. That was some other shit. You know, it was other shit going on in that situation. So that's why. That's why I don't understand when you say I think the people pitted them against each other when you and I both know why they're against each other. No, but people, people, the the people had a lot to do with that. Don't blame the people because we caught on. No. Like I go, I caught a lot of flack, uh, uh, slack, whatever the proper term is. Uh, whenever that record came out with them two, and I and I just gave an opinion. I caught a lot of heat. For that, for saying, hey, you're yeah, but two they, women against each other. But no, they were against each other. They weren't, though. They weren't. But that story came out, Mom. So it ain't even like yeah, but, I, but that, ain't but that had to do. That had that was after a lot of other things had transpi- transpired already. See, that's where you keep confusing me. You keep jumping back to what I'm saying. We know what transpired. But that was the, why they were the, that was other. the people creating attention that wasn't there from Nikki. It wasn't there. That was the okay. labels doing that. That was the machines creating all of this. This 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 friction between these two that wasn't th- I don't think Nikki had anything to do with it. Now she started speaking out against it. She saw what labels were doing. She saw what the machines were doing, and she started speaking out against it. So did, did Cardi feel some type of way about some of the words? Maybe. Is it the label that? Is it the label that? Because uh, you know what the rumor is, and don't make me say it. Mm-hmm. Is the label doing that? No, I don't. I'm. Come on, knock it off, man. I, would, I, would, I don't know I don't know I don't know I don't know enough about it So I can't speak on it I don't know So I'm gonna just stay there right, I don't know Let's do that Yeah we, I don't know yeah, Let's do that I don't know I'm not gonna <laughs> speak on it But from what we've heard it may, Wait what may do you know Rory started something with Hey y'all won't talk about it And then me and Maul Saved the topic With shit that we wouldn't talk about you said uh, we're not even going to talk about it, and then you guys didn't say it, and then alluded that you both yeah, knew. Yeah, but you came in with the take. <laughs> like, what are you told? You didn't say shit. I don't. Rory came in with the take that I just said five minutes before off air because said you weren't we, going to say it. We on air. wouldn't talk about it, and then me and Maul bodied him on it. You guys said Ooh, nothing. Smash, smash, you guys said, "Yo, we're not going to talk. We're not going to talk about it, but we're not going to say it." But you know what we're talking about. How is that yeah, covering? That's talking it? about it. Like, no, it ain't. About it. That is talking. Everyone about listening it. don't know what you're talking about because you guys are industry insiders. But, yeah, they're pod, talking about hey, it. When you listen to this podcast, read between the fucking lines. How about that? <laughs> See, that's not talking about. Use your vowels. Yeah, come on. You know the vibrations. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the 
vibrations. <laughs> what? Good vibrations. Okay. That's what we all after. Well, that wasn't the topic. You guys just talked about... See, this is how I know you... you you should have been a lawyer. We weren't even talking about Cardi and Nikki. You guys bodied a topic that we bodied three years ago. Again. We're talking about Meg <laughs> we and Nikki. We that bodied the re release. Yeah. <laughs> we we just the remastered. remastered. Yeah, we remastered. I heard the tambourine a lot clearer this time, yeah. guys. Come on, so, so, like, like I said, to prove my point again, you guys aren't going to talk about it. You're going to talk about a different yep. topic and I, say you did it. I hate, Rory's when, fired I, up. I hate when he turned pink. <laughs> it's my hope. Yeah, pink Rory's yeah. different. Yeah. It's instead of my green. Bring the redhead back. No, Rory, I'm not. So, when Rory turned pink, it's on. What's up? <laughs> oh, you're right. Anyway. I know. Come on, back to your fucking shit with this shit. I just said you guys wouldn't talk about so it. So none of y'all just going, all right, so, all right, don't leave but me. But you didn't I, see it. You I, didn't I, see none of the clips, though. I'm not going to watch it. I, I just think that Nikki has learned from her Cardi mistake. That's what I think. Okay. Which is what Rory just said. Which is a great thing. Learn from your awesome. mistakes. Of I course. Think I think it's awesome. I think it's. And I think she really likes Mick. I don't mm-hmm. think it's phony. I agree with that, too. Mm-hmm. I, I think that's awesome. I think that's awesome. I, I'm, I'm going to go back. I think that Nikki never had an issue with Cardi. I think she actually likes Cardi. I think that other people created something. They created friction. But I think those two together, I think they'll get along. Minus the bullshit. Minus people putting their energy into some shit that doesn't exist. I agree Because with that people too. create beef. Sometimes I, I agree with that you too. think you have beef with somebody or somebody has a beef with you and then you meet them and you have a conversation and realize, like yo, every, we never had like an issue. Every Joe it was up. everything around us. Yeah, I agree exactly. with that. You know what I'm saying? So that's how Wait, I feel about Nikki and Carter. <laughs> what do you say? Like almost every shot. Joe pull up. He was paying you back for the whole pink thing. Yeah. He will do that for the rest of his podcast. It's fine. <laughs> um. <laughs> uh, I like a record for the two of them. Nikki so, and May? Yeah. yeah, of course. I was glad this happened. <laughs> Rory's the label I'm telling you <laughs> I would like just a, a I would like a record From them too Yeah You wouldn't uh, I would It would be cool I, I'm not requesting That that happen now Because you said It makes you label No <laughs> <laughs> You wouldn't want to hear A record from them too No why not? <laughs> How come I keep saying I mean, no, that was why the first not? time you said no? I hate this podcast. You danced. I swear I hate this podcast. Why not though? You be swearing you way more direct than you no, are. No, it's dancing. It took you three asks to say no. I have to rewind like, well, the tape. I mean, anyway. I don't know. Why not? Yeah, why not? Uh stylistically, I just I I wouldn't put them together. Stylistically? Yeah. You don't think that their styles match? I think that I think that Nikki would I think Nikki is versatile, so I think that she would make it match. Mm-hmm. But naturally, no, not at all. I don't see. I don't. Uh, I got Meg on the on the three six bounce with a certain flow with certain content in every song. And Nikki's content is, if I'm just just looking at lyrics and not looking at who's saying them, it looks at that shit like peasant shit. <laughs> I mean, but Nick, a lot I think of, a lot, of a lot of early Nikki shit was like is, that. Nah, I totally it's, it's agree shit. with that. It's southern shit. When she moved to Atlanta, she was rapping on a lot that. of southern yeah, shit. I don't agree with that. I don't agree with Nikki? those two takes. At Nikki was rapping on a lot of southern shit before. I'm not yeah. talking about the Nikki style rapped, of music. Early on, Nikki rapped on the southern rapper beats, and y'all know what I mean. Yeah. Meg is picking Atl- Atlanta sound. That, yeah, Meg. That's... Meg is picking the bounce that beat. I don't know the proper term. I'm not from Memphis. I think Nikki can do all that. It's more of a Memphis, Houston Houston thing. Well, no, but the the bounce is kind of a Memphis thing. Yeah, you're talking about Meg. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't necessarily know. So, but I'm just saying that's not the record that I would, you know. Well, I I I agree with your early point that Nikki is versatile, especially with her pockets, and I think she could. Meg could just be Meg, and Nikki will find a way. I agree with that. I agree. I want to hear it. Do you think it's in the works? Yes. Actually, I think it's probably the record is probably. I was about to say if, if they were smart, it's done <laughs> I now. Think it's done already. <laughs> this this was I the start was of the, how we're putting it out. Yeah, y'all are right. I think it's done. Y'all are right. Y'all just answered the question. They were smiling was. too much. They was uh, <laughs> like they knew something. Just flinging their head over their shoulder too much. For Nicki, <laughs> <laughs> that's cold. They got for, a slap. That's cold for we got some shit coming. <laughs> for Nicki Minaj, who I deem to be that's the, that's the same way when rappers stand in the club together with bottles of champagne. It's the same thing. Yeah. Like, oh yeah, I got something coming. You say you already. You guys know never 20 stand times. next to each other at the club. Yeah, you already know what it is. Twenty times. Once niggas you, you already, already know, know what it is. is. Twenty times. <laughs> Record is done. Yeah. Trust me. Once <laughs> the niggas say, "Yo, you already know what it is." The record's done. Yeah. No, we don't know. You guys, yeah, know. y'all know what it is. Yeah, I, I just saw that happen with uh, Two Chains and Future. Oh, the record's done. Definitely. No, well, that's. Well, I, mean, I think it. they said it in the yeah, caption. They, they said it. They oh. said it. But I mean, in the beginning of the video, before I read the caption, it was a bunch of y'all been waiting for this. Mm-hmm. 
It's like, uh oh, <laughs> I'm, I'm ready. <laughs> if I wasn't waiting, I'm yeah. waiting now. Then it was just them two. It was like, all right. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, that record, that record is done. <laughs> Y'all been waiting for this, and then it was, it was just them two. <laughs> Just waiting for them two to have a conversation. <laughs> I was not waiting for those two. <laughs> that wasn't the two years waiting. Not on? at all. And I fucked with both of them individually. But you know, I guess amid amidst the rumors of whatever rumors existed between them two, people would be waiting for that collaboration, especially out there. So yeah, especially it. in Atlanta. I understand but, it. Yeah, yeah, good, but good I, for them. Yeah, but the, the, when when that happened, the record's got to be fired. Yeah, <laughs> like don't black Republican us. <laughs> yeah, I agree. <laughs> Roy won't say it. Yes, I will. <laughs> Rory won't say it. The hook is the hook is dope. Listen, for, 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 for Nicki, it is. Nicki Minaj, who I deem to be uh, one of the uh, one of the, I just think she's an amazing businesswoman, mm-hmm. uh, and I think she's well aware of her platform and her power. So for her to take that over to uh, a platform where she does not own, when she has one that you know. She probably has a little more invested in uh, for her to do that on Facebook slash Instagram for I'm going to say it's a conversation, but it, it was uh, it was interview esque mm-hmm. from the clips I saw anyway. Mm-hmm. Nikki ain't just doing that to anybody. It has to be a respect level there. You're right. Yeah. All of that tells me, yeah, y'all are absolutely right. That record has to be done. It's done yeah, right, yeah. and true. it seemed like ever since that podcast where I said, uh, "Okay, I'm I'm seeing." Uh, I think it was after the pull up where I said, "All right, Kevin was there." That's telling me something different. Or when I said Kevin is running around with her, it's telling me something different. That button they pressed on her, woo, <laughs> on Meg, you say? Yes, and that's what niggas like Wale are beefing about, y'all. <clears throat> Honestly. I know I, if, if that conversation is never had here because y'all wonder like why we talk about certain shit as it pertains to certain artists and certain labels. When you hear artists complaining, they're complaining about the button and mm, the support, what it means when it's pressed to push. Yeah, that Meg button is a hard press down nah, all the way down. That, that, it's Meg yeah. and Khaled. It's Meg on nah, that little Nas Fallon. button. That little Nas button was a big button. I don't what, think what, it was. What, what did Lil Nas do? Came out of nowhere and has the biggest oh, song so of all time. I thought he did something for Megan. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, no, no. That's no, 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 no they no, hit the big hit button. On, they hit oh, the big well, yeah, button of course. Nice. Of course. <laughs> I but think, I think a lot of Meg shit. I think I, they I, looked at metrics, and that was the smart decision. Oh, of course. Okay. Of yeah. course. That's all they look at. Yeah. And then they just kept dumping money because they kept making money. But a lot of times. Which I view a little differently than picking you. And before you really get the traction that garners this type of button, I'm, I know it's you. I'm pressing this button, and we're going to watch it grow. Mm-hmm. Well, with her, you could see her building her shit for the last couple of years. So it makes that's a calculated move as well. Yeah, but even when they just do the metrics thing yeah. with that, that's why it fails a lot of the times, even with the money. Because like, they're only going off metrics. And yeah, not and, like, and why Meg works. Pulse. Yeah, why Meg works, because it's not just because there's money behind it. She's authentic in who she is. People can relate to her. Like women feel like they know her. They want to be like her. It's a little different <laughs> than just looking at Spotify and seeing, all right, she did this many numbers. Right. And that's Y'all the difference right. between the labels failing and succeeding. It does come down to who the artist really is. Not sure. so much the money. Yeah. Y'all all right. Do we put, since we're talking about two artists, we put any merit to Chris Brown and Drake standing next to each other saying something's coming? I don't want to get to that just yet. Wasn't that the video? I don't want to. I still don't. I thought it was after that. the video. Oh, it was, okay. I still don't want to get to that just yet. Let's stay here, because uh, Savon said something earlier. Because I didn't watch this, but Savon made mention of that they kept mentioning or Nikki kept crediting Meg for writing her own lyrics. Mm-hmm. Okay. Right. Mm-hmm. That's awesome for them. That's great. I want to put a stop to uh, people complimenting themselves being taken as insulting <laughs> someone else. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Okay, that has to stop. Like they can big up the fact that they write their own lyrics without us immediately going to Cardi. Mm-hmm. Oh, right. Without us immediately uh, saying, "Ooh, it's a diss. It's a slight. It's a it's a sub. It's a no." I'm bigging myself up because I take pride in writing my own shit. The end. Right. Like, don't make this a thing when none of us made it a thing when all the Drake shit came out because we fuck with Drake. 
Like, if it's not a thing, then it's not a thing. Like, I know it's not the hip hop I was raised in, but if you just. I don't know. People tried to make that Drake thing a thing. Oh, please. They did. They but did. I think, it I think it just what, wasn't that successful. They, they did, though. But I think what helped that was when Quentin Miller came out and said his piece. And also, and can, can we please say, before we continue on with this, there's a big difference between. Please say the baby? Of course. <laughs> well, that goes without saying. That was rhetorical. Right, that's true. Yeah, come on. <laughs> that's true. Uh, there's a big difference between Drake's writing allegations and Cardi's writing mm-hmm. allegations. Yeah, no, so I, let's agreed. not compare these two. Agreed. No, like, we're just talking about we're just talking about making it a thing if if you don't write your shit. Yeah, that's all. Is that I believe that statement, Rory? But is it fact based? What What's fact based? Is what he just said fact based? Because I can't tell you for fact what percentage of Cardi's rhymes she's actually involved in. I can guess, and I think it would be a pretty good guess. But I do not know that for fact. Mm -hmm. And that's Cardi's argument every time someone says it. Nigga, you're not in the studio with me. You have zero idea what I'm contributing Uh, to this song. I agree. I think you misunderstood what I was saying. I'm talking to the level of the degree of writing that it takes to put a Drake record together than to write a Cardi verse. Oh, well, then you want to have a conversation about... I think about, it's a different degree of writing. But then, well, of course, but that would change this conversation to people that create records and people who purchase records. And on top of that, even with what you said, I still think there's a way bigger perception that Cardi writes way less than Drake would write. Cardi's records are purchased records, in my yeah. opinion. I cannot prove that. Mm-hmm. While maybe while I'm sure Drake has purchased a record or two in his career, because if you're an artist, you, you just have to... <laughs> Uh, I'm sure it's probably a lot more creating going on on that side. That's and that's not I'm a saying. knock to how anybody creates records. Of course not. I listen to a lot of you rappers' albums, and I can hear how you are creating your records. Mm-hmm. <laughs> right. A lot of you aren't creating your records, and then you're surprised when you don't see certain results. Like, this creation is not true to yourself. Yeah. Mm. You're just buying some shit and putting, and putting eights and twelves on it. Right. And it's easy to tell. And even if even if you don't have the ear for that type of shit, just a casual consumer can tell when this ain't you. <laughs> yeah. It just comes off. We, even if they, only so even long. if the consumer don't realize it in their own head, it's mm-hmm. the, still the same effect as someone going, that's not, we can tell. I mean, but it's only so long that fake fellas can pretend. Well, yeah. <laughs> Honestly. Yeah. Think about it. How long can I fake don't even those? know who to give that basket to. Like, y'all both, y'all both crashed the board. Yeah. Like, yeah. They're oh, fighting yeah. to jump ball. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> They're fighting um, right now. <laughs> but yeah, you can't, you, you know, we you can start to feel it. You can start to hear it. And you, you can tell. I'm shocked y'all didn't think of that. Go from parts. <laughs> and it's hip hop, as y'all say. <laughs> Label heads. Yeah, but you can start I, to feel it. I think we can agree it. on that. That you and Rory would at least be the label side. And me and Parks would be the diggable planet side. <laughs> no, I'm not labeled. In 2019? Or in 2009? Hmm? It's a different show. What? Two, are we talking about 2019 or 2009? No. Oh, no. You'd be on the label side with us. <laughs> you right here. You're right in the middle chair, buddy. <laughs> Come on. It's, it's Dame J and Biggs. <laughs> Three of us. We are not. <laughs> Dang. We are not. <laughs> not even close. Not even close. No. Not even a podcasting guys. No. No. <laughs> no, there's, no. no. We, there's a lot of niggas we know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's definitely not that. Yeah. No. Um. All right. What was we saying before I interrupted? What were you were saying? No, I was just saying. You know, with, with records, in regards to some people buying records or creating records, you can feel it after a while. You can start to sense it. Like, yeah, this. I can kind of hear who wrote this. Like, after a while, records start to sound the same. And then when writers start becoming artists, you're like, oh, okay. Yeah. I get it. You know what I mean? So, I mean, but again, I I don't really hold that much weight in that department uh, anymore because it's like, this is, to me, it's a new age. Music is different now. The way we consume music is different. The way we listen to music is different. The way artists create is different. Like, you don't even have, some artists don't even meet until years after they do a record together. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like, before you would have to almost be yeah. in the same city studio. Yeah. Now they got to meet up on Old Town Road. Yeah, <laughs> there's there's artists that hear this shit the same time we do and go, oh, that person's also on this record. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So I mean, you know, it's just a different time, but just we give had, me good music. We had some, uh, didn't we have some more girly stuff to get to? I don't know, but that could also be a great segue into Ross, Pusha, and Wayne. That's Are you? true. You <laughs> segue <laughs> himself. <laughs> I actually realized that after I said it. 
All right, come so, on. Tell us about this. Rich, do yourself the alley. Tell about these like rich it. niggas you're waiting for. Throw us the backboard to yourself. <laughs> They're all rich. Yeah, word. <laughs> like, he's throwing from one hand to the yeah, other. Yeah. Like, but he's dying to get some raw shit in here. So go ahead, man. <laughs> <laughs> live. <laughs> Well, it came out that Ross put Wayne and Pusha <laughs> it on. It came out. No, you're putting it out. No, it, <laughs> no it it's Ross, my first time hearing it. It's been out. It's yeah, my Ross, first time hearing it. I'm okay. hearing it straight from Roy. Okay. Okay. Straight well, from Relad's mouth. Relad. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us about your past, Joe. Um, there was a rumor that Ross put Pusha and Wayne on last episode, and I didn't even bring it up because it was a rumor, whatever. I didn't want to think anything of it. I've heard it. Then Ross, you heard the record. Yeah. All right. See, Parks is okay, just as interesting. Okay, Parks is not on the Diggable Planet side. <laughs> You heard the record? Yeah, I heard the song. Well, before your opinion. I told you about it. <laughs> Don't try to drag me in. Well, I'm still on the diggable planet side. <laughs> uh, All right, well, give us a take then, God damn it. Well, it's, no, Ross came out and said, yeah, that shit is true, obviously, because Parks heard it. That's what he said in the statement. Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I can't deny it now. <laughs> um, and he said, y'all was trying to mend the shit, like, in a bunch of years, we're all going to laugh at this. <laughs> and I don't think Wayne and Push are laughing now. <laughs> or you think they're upset about that? Or, uh, I don't think Wayne is. I don't see. I mean, I, I, don't I understand why knows. it's a thing, but <laughs> yeah, Wayne is. Just, I don't think he is. Yeah, I don't see how it's a thing this long after the fact. I'm, okay. I'm sure they're not upset, but Yo, I would feel some type of way. Y'all are not sure about anything. Y'all are not. That's, that's why we said think. That's not fact based. That's why we said I don't think. Now this podcast it's is fact based. Sure. I didn't say I'm sure. I said no, I don't he think. Just so. said I'm sure. Oh. Okay, I'm sure. And in parks, and in parks before that said, I don't see why they would still. I see mad reasons why they could still. Have a problem with that. If you put me on a song unbeknownst to me with somebody that I've hated for the uh, the larger part of my career, why wouldn't I have a beef about it? And I'm not saying I I, that that's what happened here. I don't know. I'm well, getting this from y'all. You didn't let me finish when I said I'm sure they're not that upset because Push, come on, man. Push is driving cars with his wife. I'm sure he's not in his crib freaking out like, what the fuck, Dwayne? I'm sure he's looking at Ross like, I don't know why you would do that shit, but I'm sure he's not flipping out mad. And I don't even think Wayne knows. That's my opinion. No, Wayne definitely. Wayne still doesn't know? <laughs> no, I don't think Wayne knows yet. Oh, no, he knows. He knows now. He may, he may not have known 48 Wayne, hours no, ago. Wayne going to find out he knows five now. years from now. <laughs> he knows now. Listen, I'm going to listen to the song if it comes out. But I'm definitely well, listening well, to the song. It's just as sleep. Definitely listening hey, to the record. They got three orchestras on the song or something. Come on. Oh. There's harps. There's oh. pianos. You can't be mad at harps. Uh, ever I think like if you put me over harps with a nigga I don't really fuck with it we I'll beef his squash to that point. <laughs> that hey, fam, we on harps you yeah. know that what I'm saying that is totally not true if we on harps if I do a verse on a record mm -hmm. and then my adversary comes on to harps mm -hmm. <laughs> and destroys me I have a huge attitude now oh yeah if I don't have harps under my vocals I have a problem yeah, but you got like the the sax and the. And I the, want the harps. The, the give great me the, piano. Give me the strings. Also, now nah, if I'm on a record, I gotta kill the person I don't like. That's, no, that's true. Like I gotta. But then again, you know, you getting on a Justice League beat with Ross, you're going in there a game with, yeah. without any knowledge of who's on it. I'm a game. I'm it don't even matter. I'm going on my a game or what Justice League record. But I would have now. Yeah. I would have thrown like a cannabis shot I'm, listen, at LL. I've, I've, all right, actually, what you about to play? <laughs> Come on, real hip hop man. <laughs> you got to dig take a us there. there. Teach us. Give us the knowledge. Come on, KRS Joe. Or Let's do it. Or you could talk and not pay attention to me so we can have a cohesive podcast. <laughs> <laughs> We're talking, Joe. Cohesive what podcast. Is. Keep What's your problem to today? I'm just saying you keep talking to me. It's millions of people listening. You staring at me, looking at me. Talk to them niggas. Let yeah, me do what I'm doing. I'm talking, talking, to, them, talking to you. We talk to each other on this podcast. We don't talk both, to them. I'm going to fight both of you. That's all. Don't worry. Grumpy <laughs> Joe is back. A word. <laughs> People rough up, weekend. Man. Fuck it. Oh, did man. three bicep curls and now he's angry as fuck. <laughs> like you're, you're a really nice oh, person this weekend. God, man, which fucking Maybach music is push on? I have to fucking guess. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Oh, yeah, but you really can't. Early. You really can't. I mean, listen, man. At this point, let's, that Wayne and, and push it is just like, all right, fam, it's over with. Yeah. There was a moment. It was years ago. I know the Drake shit might have a little listen, bit of. Yeah. I thought the, the Drake thing would have brought that to uh, a head. Two point five. My man. Yeah. A, a lot of people stayed out of that though. Yeah, we all stayed out of that. Yeah. Wayne stayed what out of that. When we're a team, Relad, niggas <laughs> <laughs> just will work against me. Wait, you're saying team? You had a Cody in this crime? Can you tell us about him? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I wanted to, I wanted to pull this pull this up just because Parks was saying all that beautiful shit. I didn't want to have to imagine. I know what Push does on saxophones and <laughs> Justice <laughs> League and harps and. Yeah, I want to hear. I know what Wayne does too. Yeah, Wayne's on one of the Maybachs. 
And just that fast, we are back into a Fab versus Jadakiss debate that we will have in two seconds. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. I'm glad y'all said that because I have a conundrum about, about those two that I want y'all to help me with. Fab and Kiss? Huh? Fab and Kiss? Um, no, about... Uh, Wayne and Push? Today. And I want to go on record. I think Push is way nicer right now than he was when he did this. Yeah. Like, way. Way. I'm saying way. I don't know about way, but... I think way, but that, think, that could I be think, argued. Uh, yeah. He's he's more uh, aggressive. Polished. I think he's more polished. I think... His it, last it, few features have been insane. The way we talk about <laughs> athletes, I just think this nigga got into the latter part of his career and his footwork just started looking different. He just started to do different things with his, with his voice, his tone, his candor. You know what I mean? Yeah, okay. His candor has stepped up a little bit. Yeah, right here, he just still sounds like raw. He's a little more candory. No. I don't know if you're cracking on me or agreeing, but... <laughs> no, I'm agreeing, I'm but... I'm still right, still and you're a, cracking a, on me. Yeah, both. Because candor. Candor. Is a, that a label thing? I'm a, yeah, I'm it label. might be. <laughs> I never heard them talk about candor. <laughs> can they, never, they never said, yo, change the candor <laughs> on that. <laughs> this candor's not a smash. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they, I never heard them say that. All right, listen. My conundrum is this. Who's a better rapper? Push it to your little way. Push it. Oh, wait, 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 hold on, 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 calm down, calm down, calm down, because Parks answered that way too fast for me, I think that Push is a better rapper, I think that they're equally talented in different ways, but I think, like, rapping, rapping, to me, Push is better. Okay, wait, before y'all continue, wait, before you continue, before you continue, because this we can argue about forever. Push don't rap better than Wayne. Today? Today. Oh, today. 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 today Push. Today. Oh, today. come on. I'm, I'm thinking we're talking about just putting everything that they we, yeah, we've I'm heard putting, of I'm them. looking at their careers. Right, I just want to get you all for t today. How do you today, feel today? Oh, today I would have push. to go. Um, You'd have last to say year. push today. Uh, yeah, today. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're all I don't know if that's fear. fair, okay. though. All right. No, it's not fair. I just one is super active. Like, super I, active. I don't think Push is that active, by the way. Hmm? Yeah, I, don't, I wouldn't uh, say super. I don't think he's super active at all. He put out three albums in, what, four years? And it jumps on features every single year. For he, someone he, that he has not put out three albums in four years. No, he has not. Hmm? No, I don't think No, he's not. Five I'm years. <laughs> all right, well, wait. Three and five. If y'all gonna do this, that's then y'all gonna walk back all that shit y'all was just on my Lupe the other day then. Because no, Push is more active than Lupe. No, he's not. I don't know about that either. What? No, he's not. Fan, how, and bodies of work, not features more. Don't do that. Because Lupe's not doing that. But I'm just saying he's more active. I'm not adding the features. 2013, more. 2015, 2018. That's not exactly that's fucking active. That's not exactly active. That's three that's albums in seven years about to be. I think that's exactly what 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 No um, no 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 he said 2013, 2015, and 2018. Yeah, I'm adding We're in, in I'm 2019. Adding in, I'm adding in all the good music album. I'm adding in there. No, please don't I'm do adding that. in all the features what he the, did. That's an active rapper. No, no, no. Yeah, that is That's active. That's an active though. rapper. That is active. He's active. I just don't think he's super active. I just don't think he's super active. He's that, more active than... That output is not super he's active. He's more active than Wayne. Yes. Listen, let's not derail. We all agree that Push Today raps better than Wayne, so that's not fair. But mm -hmm. Prime... Prime push versus prime Wayne. <laughs> Wayne. You have this as a no contest Wayne. No, really? no contest. Rory. I'm giving that edge to Wayne. Parks. Uh I'm gonna die. I'm gonna stick with I'm gonna stick with push. And you'll die on that hill. That's fine. I was always a Clips fan. I was always a Push fan. So I'm a push and clips fan too. But I'm just saying I love Prime push. Wayne. They were saying at one point he was better than Jay. Which was also not true to me. I'm just they were I, saying and I it. love Wayne. They were saying it. Clear. Clear. That was never true. They were saying it. They were, I'm not saying it was true. A lot of they would never said Pusha was better than I'm, Wayne. For what, it, for what oh, it's worth, Jay. just to back to the uh, uh, active argument, Lil Wayne also 18, 15, 13. See, cause, <laughs> yeah, just saying. But Pusha oh, push has, push has more um, features. Yeah. I don't go off the, off the features, but that's fine. Features if is active. But that's fine if y'all are. And, and people, I, people kill Andre 3000 that's, for not that's being not, active. But that's not necessarily fear because 
It's plenty of active rappers sitting in the studio right now that's not getting the feature calls because it's different reasons they're not getting the feature calls. Whatever it may active. be. But whatever it may be, they, they just, don't have verses that... They're active. They're still in there writing. We're just not hearing it on all of these other fucking... Uh, all then these that, other then, joints. If we don't hear it, it don't count. Yo, and all right. this You said I can't count that good music album. Listen to the songs that are on it before you judge that have push. Mercy, New God Flow, uh, and Don't Like. So? That's three Those songs. are three, three songs. big... Those are fucking records the that year. Big songs, but it, it, How can you not count that as being active? I can see if he was on nine of the songs. Yeah, yeah, I thought, I thought, I no, I, oh, 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 I talked about the big records Those on there. Some of the biggest oh, records. Head, I talked about head. he's on more records than that. Yeah, he's on more records on that. He's album. on almost Those every are the record. The biggest records of that. Oh, some so of the biggest records that year. Records that he's on. I thought that would help your argument more than the big records. My ear don't care about a big record. He went in the studio, laid something. If you're on three big records, that doesn't make you an active rapper. No, yes, that Lord. matters, Joe. It just no, means you shoot a high percentage. That's not true. Y'all that's not true. Y'all, y'all, are, y'all, are, y'all are nuts. Y'all are wrong. That just means he shoots a high percentage. A big record has everything to do with the business of the song. Why, it doesn't change my performance on it. Yeah. No, but he has. He, okay, but he has great performances on these records I, as well. I am directly refuting the shit Rory just said about a big record and what it means in the trajectory of an active. Still active, active, still active. but I don't think that makes a difference. If you if have a verse big, out on some of the biggest records of the year, three you're of active. them off an album, you're like, active. That's I don't know. You shoot a high percentage, man. You're active. I agree. with You You have active verses in the in the market space. You have active Immortal records. Immortal Technique has active records in the market space, and I don't hear y'all saying nothing about He's it. Active. T- I just talked about how big they were. You said that didn't matter. Now you're contradicting your point completely. He's, I <laughs> never said big. I said active in the marketplace. I'm saying if you have three you big, some, you have three big records Rory, that makes you active. Those records were Rory, big. Yeah. They, they were big on. records. Those those are are huge. Wait, wait, wait. That doesn't wait, make wait. you more or less active. Yeah, I just want to say it's only y'all that keep inserting big into this. Yeah. I, that that matters none to me, and it's not a part of my argument, and it's not what I'm saying. So if that's what you're taking from what I'm saying, I don't care about how so big the record is. If you're putting out verses, saying. you're active. That's all I'm saying. Whether it's a big record or not, if you're putting Got out it. verses, Listen, you're active. This is my conundrum today, because these these this pairing is from today. We can assume. Mm-hmm. Push raps better than Wayne today. Mm-hmm. I would expect Push to have the better verse on this song today. I agree. But I agree. Wayne is from another planet. Mm-hmm. So at any time, he can dig into that other planet bag. Right, correct. Especially if he's not super active. Correct. So I don't know what I expect to hear from these from these people on over Justice League. This is this is uh it's exciting. I, I just trust Push right now in the shape that he's in as far as rap compared to Wayne. You just don't know what, what day you're gonna catch him on. Yeah, we don't know what that, Wayne will that's get. That's why I'm saying push confidently for this Maybach 6 record. If push running uh, a, Millie Rain, a Millie Wayne, he have a hard day? Hard day. Yeah. <sighs> tough nah, well, no, I'm, I don't know about I'm not taking day. away tough, but No, I don't want to say a hard up. day. But that's a tough I'm, matchup. Again, I'm edging Wayne there. I said edge sp- purposely. I think Wayne edges him. Just because I think there's a lot more a Millie Wayne is, versatility in Wayne. Wayne's. No doubt. Rapping, if Wayne his is, pockets, his cadences, his content—like that's why I just have to put him a little bit above Push, and I'm not slighting Push at all because I love, 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 love Push. I would just put Wayne to edge him in that overall conversation. Definitely not in 2019. I think Push is cleaning Wayne up in 2019. I don't know about cleaning him up, but he'll have the better verse. Yeah, but look at that. But look how funny that is. We all think, well, most of us think that Wayne Peak Wayne raps better than Peak Push, but. Mm-hmm. Uh, Exodus is one of my favorite <laughs> diss tracks ever, and I feel like he won. <laughs> yeah, and I don't yeah. feel like he said anything like out of this world, and he won the way Push won the Drake shit. And well, me. and Wayne's uh, fuck Pusha T and everyone that love him shit was horrible to me, like horrible. Y'all still think Push won that Drake shit? No, Push. We talking about oh, Wayne? Oh, you talking about pushing? Well, Drake. Are we talking about Drake? Drake? No, he did. Yeah, he won that. He did. How? How? What are y'all basing this off? I just want to know. Wait, you talk about pushing and Drake? Yeah. He sat with us for two hours and explained it. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, uh, I don't want to repeat it. I don't it. understand what that has to do with winning the... I, I believe his points. Right. <laughs> I still don't see what that has to do with anything I just asked. But right. you, You're not beating Drake, but yes, in that are. specific yes, you are. realm. How? Push won that battle. The battle, yes. Can somebody explain how? By winning it. All right. All right. Never mind. <laughs> Never By mind. winning it. Yeah. Never mind. When the other guy says, hey, <laughs> <laughs> you lost, Maul. 
<laughs> when other guy says, "Hey, why'd you say that? You, you lost." <laughs> <laughs>
We're no, because you think of that, certain terms horrible. that they want us to get away with, yeah. and that one is still okay to use. Like everybody still uses that. I'm just like, all right, so we're gonna. It's keep... bad. We shouldn't. Okay. We gotta go to a frame. Yo, that's why. And who named it that in the first place? That's like, why we, so many that's, questions. That's why we terrible. needed you at Curl Fest. You see, true. Like who was gonna give yeah. us the gems? Progressive see? mall. <laughs> I gotta start talking like this. <laughs> the gems. <laughs> Maul is the gems. Maul's really got his clean nah, our act up. Stop before he runs to Drew League or something. Maul, what Maul he does have? About the no, I don't. Maul has the dream. Maul, yes. What are you doing? What am I doing? You heard the tape? No, no, got, that wasn't got, based off of that. Let's inform the listeners. Yeah, though. no, I tweeted that the dream. No, 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 let Rory do it. Okay, because you're gonna try and do it cool. <laughs> Yeah, it was around, it was at an odd hour too. Mm. I think it was after midnight. Mm, that is odd. It was, in all, <laughs> it was in all caps and it said, yo, the dream is about to have the best album ever created. Don't say it in all caps though. So. I'm not screaming. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't in all caps, first of all. <laughs> yes, it was. No, it wasn't. Second of all, I was just referring to the fact that he commented on Christina Milian's pregnancy post. Uh, you know he wasn't really happy, and he was. What he do? He's little, in the studio he, right now, writing little, some amazing. He hit it with the congrats, the little congrats yeah. uh, emoji. Oh, yeah. Nah, I'll be honest, more. This one sound like he meant to. Nah, he ain't mean this one. Be <laughs> I the dream is cooking up some fire right now. Nah, he meant he to. might get back with Tricky. He Maul, should get back with Tricky. <laughs> well, he should do that regardless. It, yeah. I, I think this is gonna be it. Yeah, pregnancy or not? More. You told us Dream Glass album was the best album that he was ever gonna drop. That triple, triple shit. Triple this shit. It was a good, a lot, it was a lot of, lot of music, but it was some good records on it. A lot of good records. Too much music, like Joe yeah, said. Too much music. Um, no, I think he meant it. I don't know. And I meant I'm it when more. I said he's going to drop a <laughs> classic. I don't think he meant none of that shit. If we get it, if it comes out and it says 1977 part two, <laughs> see what I'm saying? And it drops a date. Wait, let, see what I'm saying? It. Let's find it. Now Where's you on board with what I'm saying. See? So, I didn't, I didn't know that so little tidbit. Find it and let me, and let me, and let me read it. I want to see how they took that away from that. Because I really thought he was sincere. There we go. This if is we get one of these, right here. <laughs> I was sad. It's happening. <laughs> oh man! Oh my god! Mm. He went crazy on this. Mm. 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 No. All no. right, come on, come on, come on, come now on. If he comes in and, and crashes her pregnancy. Nineteen seventy seven is my favorite dream album. And I understand that That's that can fair. sound nuts. No. Can you turn this down so we can hear? What did you say? I said people look at me nuts when I say nineteen seventy seven is my favorite dream album. Probably and I understand that no, you nuts. I know why. That's because his first album. It's stupid. It but is, is the one. It's a classic. It's that that 1977 project is not even in the same ballpark as his first. That first album. one, I think production I like musically for is me. way better. But he snapped on 1977. I'll revisit it. I'm not gonna say you all. Like I don't. Nuts, I don't think. I don't think Dream. I don't think Dream was writing on paper for his first album. I think he did a lot of what he does with his melodies and his freestyles and adds in words. I think he wrote down every single word in 1977. I have here the uh, post from the King Dream. It reads, and it's long, so I'll try to be. I'll try to speed this up. I'm delighted to wait the arrival and welcome the beauty being that's on the way for at Christina Milian and her uh, husband, boyfriend, whatever it is, fiance. I don't know. Uh, I don't want to say his name. Uh, what most may not know is I've asked for this moment to be realized more than I can count. See, when I read that, I thought he might be about to get in his bullshit. Oh, he got into it. I don't think he did. <laughs> I have also made my best efforts at making sure whoever was in your life loved you and adored you. I've said if it's love, do not hide it in the dark. Let it inspire us in the, inspire us in the light. I am so happy for you, Tina, most of all. Beyond this business, there is a common love that sometimes gets left behind. A child itself cannot will that love, but two people who love each other can will that love into a child. I need to tattoo that on somebody. Uh, I told you recently and asked, what are you waiting for? 
I'm glad the wait is over. This time around, make sure no one comes in between your happiness and will to love and be loved. Love who you want and how you want. Matt. Oh, his name is Matt. I don't want to say his last name. Uh, I believe I believe in you based off our convo. She has the right human being to stand beside. Sending you much love and joy. You both should be elated. And do not dismiss a moment on this journey. Uh, a moment of this journey, it goes by at light speed, it seems. From the King Dream and Mr. Nash. Both of those are dream. Uh, we send you infinite love. Oh, Miss Nash. I'm sorry, Mr. Nash. Miss Nash. Uh, that sounded pretty sincere to me, I'll be honest. Mm-hmm. Now, why did that... <laughs> because Dream is a writer. <laughs> Keep that in mind. You just told me that he freestyled his whole first album. No, I just know his writing style. He's a writer. He can say some shit in, in a really great way, and I mean it. And basically, what he said was, I'm so happy you have somebody else now. Leave me alone. Let me move on. Yo, y'all are evil. <laughs> I didn't right. get any of that from okay. that, and I refuse to stand with you guys. What, do you got to stand? We're fucking around, Joe. I don't know them all fucking around. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I don't know nothing about their relationship. I just think that based off of that, he's got a new motivation for his pen now, and I think he's going to write from a different angle, and I'm just waiting. I need to hear it. Mature dream? Uh, mature. Last thing I want to hear. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I would say mature. Mature dream? Um, no, nah, man. Give us the immature greatness. I think he's going to start writing about I how. I love your girl. Yeah. <laughs> I, need, I need that ignorance. I love your girl. Fam, how did you I want say your that wife. to somebody? <laughs> <laughs> I love your wife. I used to be in the club. That was the joint. I used to try to lock eyes with them on. <laughs> <laughs> with the committed women? <laughs> That's love sick. your wife. <laughs> That's really sick. Yeah, here we go. Right there. You know the vibes. You is that the vibrations? Mm. <laughs> this is ha- Yeah, I'm cutting that off. Your girl, your girl was up to no good when that record was on. <laughs> <laughs> Just locking eyes with me. So you haven't heard anything? Condoning everything? You, no, 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 no. Okay. I was strictly based off of that uh, Intuition. Instagram post. Yeah, got it. Okay. Maul, Maul, this is my issue with you. And let's talk about it for two seconds. Actually, before I get into my issue with Maul, let me do a quick callback to this, this FaceTime topic. What's you guys' is, uh, peak FaceTime position? Like, <laughs> <laughs> well, do you have a... Well, start with the go-to area where the phone is. Uh, or do you guys hold the phone? It's hard. If you get no, into a long no, FaceTime, no, 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 I'm not can't holding hold the phone, phone. fam. That's for the novices. <laughs> I'm not. You hold, hold the phone depending on where you're at in the in the date in the relationship. You yeah, you hold the phone when it's new. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, but if it's if it's planned, I know we're gonna be talking for a while. No matter what, I'm I'm right here with it on the laptop, I'm putting Smart. it up against something. I'm oh, so it's up against something when it's, you you re, now reach the yeah. new level in the relationship. <laughs> Listen, when, when things you, have progressed, <laughs> yeah, emotionally, yeah, 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 yeah. When you a veteran, when you a supermax, plenty of options of where to place the phone by the lamp, yeah, uh, position on the bed, uh, I mean, every, the laptop. You you could freak it a plethora used, of I've ways. Used every athlete has their yeah, own style, their yeah, their yeah own you can, style of play. Yeah, you can score from the mid range to post. Yeah, you can hit them with the three, depending mm-hmm. on where you position the phone. Yeah, I normally hit them with the Teddy P. Luther uh, famous R and B one elbow down on the bed. <laughs> I'm gonna give you a That's little. That's how you do. You use the, comfort, you use the comfort. I'm, I'm gonna give you. I'm gonna give you probably mid torso up. Yeah, <laughs> mid torso, okay. mid torso up, and I'm a strip for you. <laughs> we were having such a good conversation. She'd be like, "Yo, what you wearing? You, you, you get up and show up." <laughs> it's a nasty. Nigga. You already, you already butt ass when the FaceTime start. <laughs> Joe is not. He keeps the top like shirt nah, hat. Nah. He'll have that going on the top. <laughs> don't do that. He butt ass from the way down. Don't t- and so I do you don't, the, want, wait, don't wait, tell wait. me you butt. Wait, and I do the slow pan. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Don't tell me you got a shirt on and you butt ass at yeah, the bottom. Yeah, Joe has definitely done that before. With the, that's, with the scully on. That's sick. He, he painted Listen, this picture before. That, that changes the game when he asks what you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what look at Rory. Doing? Hey, look at Rory now. Don't Fam. get in trouble. Don't, get, don't relate. I'm not, don't relate. I'm never, don't identify with like, it. Where, where your other hand relate. at? What you doing? Yeah, the, yo, when they hit you with the... Yo, you like, doing? Oh, nothing. And, and, and they hear the TV yeah, on. Come on. You know the vibes. Just channel surfing. 
Just channel surfing. Yeah, channel surfing. Yeah. That's what you call it these days. Yeah. Channel surfing. Yo, come on, y'all. Come on, give it to me. How, how, how y'all how y'all laying on the FaceTime, man? What you giving them? It depends. If you, if you like really, if this is like a, a dating thing, like y'all have done this sometimes, or you lay on you lay on the couch. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Hold a phone right here while you on the couch. She wanna see what you watching, you know what I mean? Might turn the camera around a little bit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Hey, That's I, when you like her, right? Yeah. When you like her, you'll turn the camera around. You show everything when you like her. Like, yo, I just got these. Yo, look. look at the cat sleep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's when you like her. Yo, look how this nigga sleep. Look, she, look, look. Now she when, don't and when care she, about how that cat sleep. Nah, that's not true. When she like you back, she asking about the pets. Yeah. yeah. It's definitely. Uh, yeah. She asking about the pets. Where is he? That was Brooklyn. You look, he's somewhere around. It's the dog will make or break you. Because I'm sure there's been plenty of times chicks have asked about Brooklyn, then seen Brooklyn maybe in like an IG pic from another account. And you get caught because of your dog. Yeah, <laughs> chicks yeah. at the crib just ig and the dog. Like, yeah, hey, what are you doing? Harlem was good for that. Chicks always wanted to catch him on the snap. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah for sure. <laughs> why did they? Uh, why? Because he, he was, was right there in the face. Yeah, he was right in their lap, yeah. trying to get. Harlem got niggas in trouble so many times. <laughs> uh, I know that dog. Have you guys stepped it up and and maybe did the laptop thing instead? Oh man, FaceTime from the laptop. Yeah. We ain't gonna talk yeah, about. We ain't gonna talk about. Yeah, that's when y'all go together. <laughs> yeah, we ain't gonna talk about that. Yeah, go together. If you open up that laptop hey, and hit that FaceTime, if I get you on the bigger FaceTime, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm trying Dogs. to see the HD. My whole chest. Dogs. Yeah, I'm trying to see the HD. Fam, I seen it on the gram. <laughs> <laughs> what, what did you see? <laughs> no, you seen it on the gram. I'm, try, I'm trying to see that shit in 3D. <laughs> That's for sure. That's in for 3D. sure. 3D. For real. I need, yeah. where's my laptop? No, for real. I'm with him. I'm with him on that. I don't that. know what Rory like. No, Rory's so that. married. I'm with you on that. That's so yeah, last he's year. Married, he's a married guy. That's so last year. Married. <laughs> so the, 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 face, the FaceTime on the laptop. No, being engaged. <laughs> <laughs> being engaged is so Man, last come, year. Come on, Rory. It's, it's 2019. Go ahead, live. <laughs> my fault. Live. He said my fault. <laughs> my fault. <laughs> um, oh, yeah, now when the laptop happened. Y'all moan? Y'all moan? <laughs> See, and that's yeah. why this podcast will never get where we it need depends, to go. It depends. It depends. Y'all, on, come on. It just depends say on where yes, it depends. No, it, yeah, just flow it depends. And just say yes, no, 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 my it, nigga. It depends. You know it gets it depends. different when you let a little moan out. It depends on how much you like her. Mal <laughs> no, no. tries to do the cooler, like ooh, don't yeah. try to moan. <laughs> no, it's a no he, he says word. He does. <laughs> <laughs> well, nigga, she spread eagle <laughs> busting open more. Your word. <laughs> First of all, that's not true. I don't know why you're trying to. Damn, that's the fire pack. <laughs> see, but what if she got the fire back? Oh what if she's burning? <laughs> see, Rory. Rory. See. Too much insulation. Wait, don't do that. You've definitely dated the bitches burning. I probably have. Of course you have. We all have. I probably have. <laughs> I would, I've been burned. Yeah. That's your girl. Yeah. <laughs> no argument here. <laughs> Yo, Rory is the man. Yo, next episode, I swear to God, we getting Rory appreciation episode. Oh, thanks, man. The whole episode is dedicated to Rory. To Rory and his CDs. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. All right. So the listeners, hey, they, that won't be a long they, episode. They I've dirty only had ass one. right off the track, team. Hey, dirty white boy, <laughs> get the you fuck out of here. Hey, grab your Puma bag. <laughs> hey, it was the, a Nike hey, bag. Get the God fuck damn it. Off the track. Nah, before you got with Cam and them, you was wearing Puma <laughs> yeah, bag. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You sure. ain't have the Nike. No, trip. I wear Puma now. That was Chris Styles. <laughs> Chris Styles, come on, Rose, man. Let's go to Nike store. Let's go to the, yeah. <laughs> Let me get you a get Nike you ID. The, get you out of this Puma. Yeah, shout out to Chris Styles for saving Rory. Me and Chris Styles saved you. We don't get enough credit. All right, what was we talking about? FaceTime, we dealt with FaceTime, right? Yeah. yeah. My beef with Maul. Um, I'm always going to help my niggas fight. <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm not that guy. Let me let the, the audience know. There's some uh, new listeners that may not be familiar with me. I don't go. If I go to the club with Maul, Rory, and Parks, and one of them can't get in the club, guess what? Joe not in the club. Now, I may hit him with a quick... Yo, let's let me go in and see. Let, if, me, go see, I'll let, be me, let me see if I can pull <laughs> something. Let me go in and see see if see what the temperature is and stay in for a minute and then come back out because I'm phony. But <laughs> I'm coming back out and I'm leaving. Mm -hmm. If my if I see one of my guys fighting, fam, fighting with my guy. Now, the issue comes when your guy is attempting to fight someone who. Is a black belt and has samurai swords. Yeah, he has mad swords. Who's it, proficient? And he climbed in, a mountain in nunchucks. 
it's different when your guy is setting you up to fight someone who you will have to train for. <laughs> you better the gym, for years. <sighs> Fail. Three days in the gym is not stopping a samurai sword. <laughs> and y'all still talking about physical violence. I'm still thinking about just bars. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen Lupe's hey, Instagram? We, we, we locked ourselves in the studio for four days with Drake. <laughs> True. I, I, would you like me to repeat that for you? <laughs> I know you think that Drake raps better than Lupe, but... <laughs> what? Why are y'all painting this? How did this turn into this? Because Lupe heard what you said, and he didn't like it. Yeah, and then I, and I knew that, that might have happened. So when he sent Smokey away, I wanted to help until I remembered I retired. I haven't written in a while. Mm-hmm. Lupe wrote murals. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like you should chill. Like I would try to talk some sense into my man. Like yo, just but yo, what he did? <laughs> no, I, I saw the deflection. Yo, Street, Street Fighter. Fighter. <laughs> but how did that? You think Chun Li is gonna say ball? <laughs> <laughs> Nikki might. <laughs> Y'all are stupid. <laughs> Y'all are really dumb. <laughs> Y'all are really dumb. How did this turn into that? <laughs> you turned it into this. Because I wasn't shit. I was we not We were trying to tell Lupe, you though. that Lupe is amazing, and you was like, And nah. I agree with y'all. I didn't say no, he wasn't didn't. amazing. You, you said he was hanging on by Elmer's glue. <laughs> we, were talk- we, were, we were talking. I asked you that specifically, and you said, we were yes, talking. We were talking in terms of if other people are more active. Would you say that they're hanging on by a thread, or would they? And I was saying, well, in, in, that, in that conversation... Then someone like Lupe would be considered as and holding on by a threat. I didn't say it. his talent was got hanging you. on by a threat. I didn't what, say he wasn't my, nice. I, I decided that one I one of my was, favorite rappers. What I was trying, well, you should sound like it. One and two, what I was trying to say, and I'm in the minority on this when it comes to uh, the casual fan and just the mainstream audience in hip hop. When a nigga could walk anywhere, and when he opened his mouth, do what Lupe does, do what 3K does. Do what? It's the same reason we're we're so enamored by Black Thought after all these years. You ain't naming a Black Thought song that we just putting on in the car and going crazy to today. But wherever he goes as a man, as an MC, KRS, KRS the same thing for that time. Yeah. When they open their mouths, Nas, it's the same. Re- Listen, Nas, they clown for picking bad beats a long for a long time. Guess what? Who cares? <laughs> When we you can walk somewhere and open your mouth and do what they do, pause if you're being immature in this moment, um, it's different. You don't, you don't, I don't grade those people on the same scale as people who are trying to forge out a career. Like, and, and that's even if they've attempted to forge out a career and just failed. If you are of the 1% and just lyricists, like Black Thought shouldn't be able to have that type of breath control today. Forward. Like I'm, I'm talking about shit like that. Like I'm just never gonna look at Lupe a, a way at, he can never rhyme again. When he decides to open his fucking mouth, it's warfare for people. So those people have to get a, just a different type of respect from me. Is what I'm saying. I think, but it got lost in what we were saying. We was, it wasn't it wasn't anything to do with ability or skill. We were talking about the music business. And I know Lupe is one of those dudes that he moves on his own accord. Like, I don't even know. Yeah. Well, I have to explain it further to because people probably didn't get that from what I was saying. No, I know. <laughs> I know Lupe's career. I know what he's done, what he's capable of. I know where he's from. I know all of that. I'm, I know all of that about Lupe. What I was saying was, in that, when, in that conversation we were having, we were comparing and we were saying how would it look to the general perception? Would it look like he's still... Heavily into the music business, would it look like he's hanging on by a thread? And I was saying it, he would be looked at as hanging on by a thread because he's not, he doesn't play the same games that all the other artists play. He's not active, he's not around, you don't see him, you don't. He's active, he's not he's active, active to the audience that yeah, okay. Maul oh, okay. is talking. This is what okay, I'm saying. I'm not gotcha. me. Yeah, I'm never speaking. Clear. About, yeah, I'm never. Sp- I know these things. Yeah, I'm never speaking yeah. about. I'm let's just talking about the beef. general perception <laughs> of it. these of this artist. Hold like, on. I want to go back with our argument. I agree that Lupe is active. I loved his last album. Yeah. But y'all cannot tell me that you didn't think Pusha was active and Lupe is active. But that's what I said too sure. earlier. I think they're both active. 
No, I'm, we were only Which debating. one of you said Bush was not active? We, no, we were debating you, you saying that he's super active. We, Correct. Me oh. and Parks, super, and, I so do, super Parks and I think that there are artists that are super active. Correct. That's all. Okay, never mind. Continue yeah, on. Yeah, Brian Wave. Continue on. Super active. Oh, my. Yeah, yeah, the yeah, most yeah, active rapper super. next to Pac. That was the most active for his year for any run. rapper, I think. <laughs> yeah. But, um, yeah, so that's what I was saying when it came to Lupe. So when he tweeted, <laughs> when he tweeted that, I was like... Uh, I don't know how that got lost, but here we are explaining it. So yes, that's what I was I trying wanna, to yeah, say. I that's wanna, what, what I was trying I to. I want to explain. I don't want like I don't want. Yeah, no, that would be. I mean, come on, man. I, I I think y'all know that I know I, I more. I did about love me. that Lupe replied to you trying to change topics by keeping on topic <laughs> and said, "Nah, I know I beat you in that too." But back to your man. <laughs> yeah, man. I mean, I fuck with Lupe. I don't think. I mean, I don't think that needs to be explained. Let's just bring the the. Bad energy back to Saha or something. <laughs> no, it wasn't no bad. But I, I don't even know how that how that how that would because come across it, as. I just want to leave Lupe alone. That's it. As I, I, I think I don't and know. I think it's a wise decision. Yeah, it's work. Did like, he listen to the yeah, entire I segment? Don't know. I don't know. But when the nigga niggas got guns, like I don't. Know. Uh, yeah, he would have to listen. I, don't to know. I think if you listen to that entire segment, you would know what I was saying. But somebody ever, probably you, sent him a clip. If you ever tried to explain yourself to like a street nigga, it sounds just like. This like yo, did you hear what I said? The whole thing, they don't be nah, caring. Nah, man. I don't. Yeah, but that's why you got to listen to the whole clip, the whole segment. Well, we can leave Lupe alone, so I ain't gotta I go fu- spend a month in I the studio. I fuck with Lupe. I don't know how many times I gotta hey, say that. Hey, Lupe, and be clear, nigga. I'm riding with Maul, so watch your fucking mouth, <laughs> nah, please. <laughs> Like respectfully, if you, yeah, if you want, if you want, if, if you want to watch whatever it, you want to do, <laughs> yo. But if you don't yo, feel like it, if you want, <laughs> yo, Lupe, I don't want there to be no misunderstandings. If something pop off, you already know the side I'm on. I'm riding with more. I dare you. If you want. Yeah. I mean, truth or dare. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. More like truth or dare. <laughs> Pick truth. Hey, Mo, no, sorry. Sorry, bro. Sorry, bro. And this is why you phony. Because pick niggas that you could go call St. John to handle. Don't pick niggas I got to handle. Nah, it ain't nothing to hit. I fuck with Lupe. What are you Listen, talking about? Don't. That's a wild battle. <laughs> Cause Ma, see that? That's why Maul got to respect me. Cause Maul don't have no niggas that he can send to the wolves when the wolves come in. Him. He hang out with like the you know the niggas that's got swag and shit. Okay. Maul, Maul might be down with the swag rap. You might be the swag rap of this podcast. No, I don't think. What so. lyricists you know outside of Hove? <laughs> okay, <laughs> that would be the one. Just make another one. <laughs> make another Hove. <laughs> That was good. Make another hole. I don't get my props. That was pretty good. You did that. That was funny. I liked it. I liked it. You got your props. I liked it. You got your props. You got your props. You got your props. The props are given. All right, good. What else? Where else we at, man? Chris Heron was nice. And Lupe is still running. Chris Heron was super nice. Yeah. And Lupe is running for me in the Street Fighter smoke. Y'all have been going back and forth for. He says he's the world champion. I know because they rigged it for him to beat the world champion or play competitively against whoever uh, the world champion was, he was at that time. Performance Lupe, hits. Lupe, I know the business behind it. <laughs> I, I know what happened. I know what they did to get the uh, audience up. <laughs> Ooh, this is competitive. Who will win? It was like the when Mayweather fuck? fought yeah, this fourteen-year-old. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who you picking, Street Fighter? Everybody. Okay. Chun Li. I'm one of those. I'm one of those. He's a Chun Li guy. Okay. You, uh, you Zangief. I get busy with Chun. Him. Mm, Eon the Dolphin. I'll kick your ass, you pig dog. No, you would never. You would never. Long ass. Fam, we can go right. We can go right down. Uh, there's a video game spot right on 37, 36, 35. One of those whole arcade. Anytime anybody wants to see me in Street Fighter, I'm readily available. I'm <laughs> readily available. We could tape it. We could film it. Okay. Same thing happened when Joel Ortiz, Crook, and them niggas start challenging me. Beat they niggas ass perfect thirty times in a row. Stop. <laughs> perfect. Did you? Did you? Crook, play Cray, them? Crook, and all that lyrics are perfect. <laughs> perfect. <laughs> <laughs> all, all that lyrical man. Perfect. All you can. <laughs> oh, da, da, da. It was crazy, man. All that lyrical shit. Nigga, shut up. <laughs> Sit your ass down the corner somewhere. That's funny. Did you be Wale and Neo that day? No, Neo, Neo had a blast with me. <laughs> Neo was kicking everyone's ass. Neo that had a blast. I didn't see out. Yeah, but but that was on, in my defense, that was on a, a console, a new console, and I don't play on consoles. Oh, okay. So that, Arcade that or was, nothing? Yeah, okay. that would have been no. Usually, I don't take your no side, but yeah, that's that. It'd be different when you got no, a whole different, different controller. Very different. And it, that Neo is super nice on that console, along with a few other people that get busy on the console. I'm old. I need to. I need the arcade. So yeah. Okay. I would tear the floor up with Neo on the arcade. <laughs> 
That's just a funny ass sentence. <laughs> it, is, it really is. Pause. No, no, no it wasn't a pause. pause. It's just a funny they sentence. They already think I'm gay. Whatever, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not right. trying to argue the other side of things. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it would come back to bite me. Pause. You need Joiner to do like a straight version of you? <laughs> this podcast is disrespectful. <laughs> and October ain't going to help none of this shit. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, Lupe, we apologize for Maul. On behalf of Maul. <laughs> yeah, don't hurt us. And yeah, yeah please. We apologize keep, keep for the, I just said we said oh. sorry to this nigga. Just, My bad. <laughs> uh, thank you. And fans, don't go. We just said out of fit. Maul just, Maul started this with the fans be starting shit. Fans, don't go at and Lupe. Yo, Maul's back at it. Now, that's how this, I don't think Lupe listened to that. I think somebody just kept hitting him saying, yo, nigga said you hanging on by a threat. Well, do, I, I do, don't know does it matter if the sword goes in you? Yes. Nah, nigga, just be like, what's 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 the shit? Uh, Macbeth, Macbeth, Macbeth. They died by the sword. What was Romeo and Juliet? One of them shits they taught you in school. Yeah, they were Both, all. There were swords. There were swords and all of them. Pause. Maul Beth. <laughs> <laughs> Maul and Betha. <laughs> Y'all just everybody shooting, huh? How many basketballs do we have today? Everybody shoot. Somebody did this. <laughs> somebody did this. <laughs> somebody, hey, somebody, somebody did this. Did this. <laughs> Yo. Yo. Yo, that was my that that phrase the whole weekend. That's Anytime something happens, somebody did somebody this. That's going in the drop machine at, somebody point, did at some this. point. Fab, you're just going to have to hate us, nigga. Somebody, somebody did this. Somebody did this is one of the greatest lines of 2019. Because <laughs> sure. somebody did. Yeah, at the end of the day, somebody <laughs> He did he's do. not wrong. He's Somebody right. Did it. Yeah. Stay woke. He's right. right. He's right. He's absolutely right. Stay woke. Somebody did do. We it. wasn't woke. <laughs> That's it. We didn't know that someone did this. <laughs> Fab woke us up. Who is the somebody? Yo, what else are we talking about? Because <laughs> y'all are gonna ruin all my relationships <laughs> <laughs> with people. How? Yo, more. You said yo, it. more always says you brought, how when it's painfully obvious said, how. <laughs> you brought up. You said somebody. It's going in the drop machine. That was all your bars. <laughs> <laughs> that ain't, I didn't say that I'm just agreeing I, It's one of the greatest quotes Now you malad I'm a lad. <laughs> <laughs> Let me switch my phone Oh shit Katy Perry Katy Perry Katy Perry Yes <laughs> Katy Perry's getting sued Somebody tell me What's going on With uh, Katy Perry And her being sued For X amount of dollars Cause she ripped off Whatever <clears throat> So this group Flame uh, Oh they got fire Is suing For this song Called Joyful Noise Featuring Lecrae Flames. It's a Christian A Christian uh, Rap I saw with Lecrae. Lecrae is super dope. And I don't know these other guys. Uh, John Riley and <coughs> Flame. I'm not sure who they are. So they're saying that... Uh, that, the, that. That beat there. That sounds like... That is oh. Joyful Noise. Wait, who Life created Flame? that sound that you just played? Uh, joyful Noise. I'm not sure who the producer was. It may joyful have been Noise. It may Got have been it. self-produced. They're saying Dark no. Horse. Uh... Yeah, but I'm also. Hmm. All right, let, let me hit. Let me hit the other one again. Yeah. Because I know we uh, when we were talking about this earlier, we dismissed it a little bit. When you played it, just. Oh no, I'm rolling. That's a tempo switch. Same thing. Same thing. Tempo switch. But but to Park's point, what are you saying on it's air? A, it's such <laughs> a simple beat. Like I think every producer has a beat that sounds something in that range. Listen, that's I've heard that beat that's a true. million times. There's, there's no original. True. You've gotten batches of beats. That's true. Yeah. I don't think that there's any original. When you listen to music, you can, if, if you are a music librarian, you can find a record that sounds like every record. Correct. I think so. That's so of, shit like this is stupid to that's me. That's part of the art of DJing. <clears throat> that's what I'm saying. Shit like this is just stupid to me. That's like, Good point, Parks. There's no original... True. Sound. It's like if you hit this note, that note is in a million other records. Okay, but in their defense, let's try to understand here. They're not talking about records in a similar vein. That's not what. Yeah, they're not talking about lyrics or anything. They're just talking about the beat, I guess. Yeah, the, the notes, the sounds. Yeah. The, the, and they're not saying it's in the same vein. They're saying it's, it's the, the same. same. Correct. So, do you think that these two are the same? And it does not matter that we think. There are a billion of these because I agree there right. are. It only matters that one person said, hey, they'll probably, they'll probably this win the suit. one came first. Yeah, they'll <laughs> probably win the suit, honestly. Yeah, that's what No, I'm, no, they won. Oh, they did but, win. Oh, they, they won. won. Now they're oh. waiting to see what the penalty is. Oh, okay. Um, but I had a question for you guys, which well, none of us are lawyers here, so I, I guess we can if ask. Well, can we read switches. a piece from our article, please, yeah, just so I can understand? Yeah. I didn't know if that's what Rory was about to do. Uh, yeah. I was going to switch, but I can go to the, the top of it. 
Uh, a jury on Monday found the Katy Perry 2013 hit Dark Horse improperly copied a 2009 Christian song in a unanimous decision that represented a rare takedown of the pop star and her elite producer by a relatively unknown artist. So That's not fair. I don't like that. The, the uh, verbiage maybe, they use? I, yeah, I, yeah, I don't like none of that. That's yeah. horrible. Yeah. So I guess my next I hate lawsuit question. chasers. I'm not calling these kids that, but or whoever these people are that. That beat is even too hard to be a Christian song. <laughs> <laughs> Chance would find a way. <laughs> not judging by that album. <laughs> no, no, he wouldn't. I wish he would find a way. That would be super hard. Yeah, you should have called. Tell, Fl- me, tell should... me about your wife over that beat. He should have called Fl- <laughs> Flame. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Chance should have Flame. Uh, and it's fucked up because I want uh, Chance. We're gonna have a conversation. I got you know. I, I I owe y'all an apology for my Chance take. We'll get to that later. Okay. Uh, well, I had questions for y'all, even though we're not lawyers. Uh, the verdict by a nine-member federal jury in a Los Angeles courtroom came five years after whatever, whatever, forget all that shit. Questions from the jury during their two full days of deliberation had suggested that they may find only some of the defendants liable for the copyright infringement. I want to know how they're picking a jury when we're talking about notes, because they said it's not lyrics, it's just the notes in the song. Correct. So you're picking just 12 people from L.A., it that, seems like that they couldn't get have, out of jury uh, duty. Musicologists to, or whatever. Yeah. Yeah. But then I also feel that way about criminal shit too. But this one specifically, like how are you gonna ask a bunch of random people if they think they sound that the that's the same? Right. <laughs> I that think is a good question. I, I think this is corny. That's corny to me. The lawsuit? Yeah. Listen, man, there's no original if it's a tempo change, it's not the same. Uh, it's not the nah, same. That's not true, it's the same. My problem with it is that it's so barren musically like I could see if it was like a complex melody or something like even the uh, Pharrell and uh, Marvin Gaye thing like that was clearly Pharrell reinterpreting that record they should have cleared it I don't know why they didn't (laughs) well well you are absolutely right my beef here is they switched the whole argument from Cardi trying to copyright or trademark O'Kurt their exact response to her should be the exact response here it's too vague of a term to say that you are the originator and X, Y, Z, blah, 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 blah. Go look it up. I'm not fact man. Right. That's what they should have said here as well. It's too vague of a beat for me to say that you are the originator of this sound. Doom, this, doom, yeah, doom, like, doom, come doom, on. Doom, doom, it's two notes. Yeah, come on. Well, but also, you well, want to point out in here, the defendants... Of the uh, it, it's a it's like a half step note. It's it's one key well, to the next. Okay, key. so the progression and the degression. <laughs> <laughs> They're suggesting that they may only find the some pattern. of the defendants. So I don't know if that means. I know the it means the Katie, producers. Yeah, I don't know. If they're putting Katy Perry's name obviously, so it gets clicks. But I, maybe that works in her favor of her saying, "Fam, I showed up to the studio and they had this beat. I liked it. I sang on it. We're not even talking about the lyrics. Why am I even here? Right. So while you say it's corny, Joe, if I'm a producer to producer. And there may be a story here we don't know that they may have some type of connection. I think, no, you're right. If so that, if that right, is the case. You're like, right, you're right. So, like, let me, I, so let me walk it back. I'm not saying that this or they are corny. I don't know enough about this to be able to decide. Mm. I think that lawsuit chasers are corny. Yeah. That's what I'll say. Oh, of course, yeah. I mean, that shit. And this happens. Like, do you think that Marvin's gay family, do you think they chase lawsuits? or do you think, Absolutely. Or do you think they have <laughs> think a they, case on I the think case. they had a case I think they chase record. them, but I think they have a, a they had a case, good but case they, every and now time. they're definitely chasing. They're going to listen to a lot of other I think records. every time they turn on the radio, they have their ear right there. All right, come on. <laughs> Give me they, another one. Did they have a step to Adorn? They did, they did get, get Ed Sheeran, yeah. But did they, they they got Ed Sheeran, they got uh happy uh okay. well, they got uh, Arj Lad. That, now you're snitching they got on, that on, fast on record. them. Did they yeah. did they get Miguel? Snitching on Miguel? I don't know if they got Miguel. They didn't get Miguel. I don't know. How the fuck did they you're miss snitching. Miguel? Yeah, I'm Vlad, right here. <laughs> How am I snitching? The Miguel song is out. He, he made it clear. <laughs> it's an old song. He made it clear. Yeah, it, that's that's another thing. That's these other artists the may have thing. cleared their thing. Like yeah, I, I don't understand records. how they didn't clear that record, the Pharrell record, and Robin Thicke record. Because they didn't think anybody that heard that record that has. Listen to music <laughs> was like, oh, that's Marvin Gaye. Someone, but maybe, they blatantly I'm, said, no, nah, we're not going to No, that's this. not true. That's yeah. not true. They, they didn't have Pharrell and Robin Thick. I mean, uh, Ro- not Robin Thick. Yeah. 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 I'm thinking of Alan Thick. Yeah. Well. They didn't have Pharrell and Robin <laughs> Thick and say, oh, this will sneak by. <laughs> well, I think that they thought that because it was, it was an interpretation that it that, would sneak by. No, I thought that they thought, they, thought they, they were, were in the clear right. because right. it was in. 
they thought they made enough changes to the beat. Right. Yeah. Correct. So it was they felt influence. like they didn't have it to do it. I'm sure they were surprised when the, the gay family stepped up. Like, yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> Fam. <laughs> You're not happy? Was it happy? What was the, what was the song? No, it was... No. Uh, not happy. Uh, uh, blurred Lines. Blurred Lines. Blurred Correct. Lines. Yeah, the lines were blurred. <laughs> <laughs> Well, no, I, I remember hearing John Legend uh, talk about this in an interview. He got clipped for uh, three words. Where are you? Wow. Because someone had proof that they did. It was like a meet and that greet. they knew where he was. Yeah, no, it was a meet and <laughs> greet. And the dude came into court and was like, look, we met on this date. I gave him my demo. You see my demos in my hand in the picture. Shit. Uh, and then John Legend couldn't come up with the words, where are you, in his whole entire category of music. <laughs> the court. And, That's why it's dangerous. And he lost. To, <laughs> it's dangerous to uh, listen to demos. Should never take demos. Or accept demos. That's why, you know, but it's tough for a new artist or some, or an aspiring artist to understand this. That's why I won't really listen to a demo. Because God forbid I create something that you have on there. Right. Well, that's what happened with John Lutt. John was like, yeah, dog, no. I, never, I don't even remember this meet and greet. Right. I yeah, bet. You, you yeah. think I couldn't come up with where are you? <laughs> John Legend could come up with where are you. He was going to sing so that saying, this boisterously is... nine times during this a chorus. Tom, Tom Petty clipped, uh, what's the name? What's the uh, British singer name? Boy George? No, the young kid. I don't know. Anyway, it was a, a chord progression. One Direction. It was a chord progression. No, oh. Joe likes him a lot. Uh, oh, uh, Stay with me. Uh, oh, 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 Sam Smith. Oh, Sam Smith. Sam Smith. Sam Smith, my God. Yeah, 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 they clipped too. him for a chord progression. It's like, come on, man. But I liked him when he was going through a breakup. He's back in love, and I ain't nothing yeah. been fire. Nothing has been fire. <laughs> like when you're sad over gospel chords, I was like really intrigued. <laughs> now you're just in love over pianos. <laughs> stay, stay with me was for real. <laughs> yeah, it was. And I think at the time that dropped, I wanted a chick to stay with me. <laughs> Sounds about right. How you want somebody to stay with me? <laughs> <laughs> what I, just sit down. Why you got to yeah. stand up, man? Well, I just want you to sit down. I just want you to sit down, though. Just sit down. <laughs> I'm in agreement with you. You said it, I agree. Yeah, but Damn. you're like confirming it. I'm just agreeing. <laughs> Damn, I can't even agree with nobody. Damn. Oh, man. What's your vibe at the pool party, boy? Uh, what time What time is it? Hawaiian t-shirt? Oh, like what am I? What's, I don't know what I'm wearing. I don't know. No, nah, I don't really want to know what he's wearing. I just want to know his vibe. Uh, what's, what's your vibration? It depends on the time. You know, it changes with the time. All right, let's say it starts at one, two o'clock. Give me five o'clock more. Mm. Uh, that's peak popularity, yeah. right there. Yeah, we need to. It's a lot of that's that's when you get in the text. Need, Yo, some, what house is it? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> and you egging it because you already got something park. in front of you. Yeah, five o'clock. The sun is. It's still high out. in the oh, sky. Oh yeah, yeah, high yeah. up there. High oh, we, up there. oh, we need city girls. We need sweetie. We need uh, mm, rich nigga, rich nigga. Yeah, that's we need all of that. What were we gonna do in that? I'll be on. I'll be on the balcony. <laughs> my shirt on. <laughs> Alone. <laughs> Rory is a Rory, Rory is a dirty That's white boy. I'll be on the balcony alone. Rory is shirt such a wave, wave boy. my shirt like Petey Pablo. <laughs> That's hilarious. Yeah, you need sweetie. He's gonna be up there with a rich nigga too. <laughs> he gonna be waving. Uh, he gonna be waving his hand on the balcony with a. <laughs> <laughs> and you just look up and just the two of us. Listen, That's listen. Nasty. I have a theory in my head. That's listen, nasty. just watching the timeline, watching dudes, dudes like rich niggas the same way girls do. That's Maybe disgusting. more in this era. Oh Maybe pushing God. the chicks away oh to get to her. God, you nasty fucking creeps. <laughs> disgusting. That's gross. It's nasty nasty men. It is. Nasty, nasty men. Super nasty. Don't don't, uh, don't invite none of people to my pool party, Rory. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not playing with Rory. Let's get into some misogyny with the pool party. Is there a, a time frame with certain chicks that you invite? Because you said 5 p.m. Like after 6 p.m., I may not reply to like maybe a, a 2 p.m. I'm cutting my chick phone off. from the list. No, no, I'm cutting my phone off. Yeah, my phone's cutting off at no the No way time. in the world. Hey, past 7. If you ain't here at 7, nah, we ain't talking no more. Okay. Find it on your own. Just show up. But nah, don't do that. Okay. All right. So you're across the board. You don't want to have a misogynistic ledge with me. I'm, I'm cutting my phone off. Yeah, I'm not doing that. And I got that from all. Like, normally I would try to, like, be nice and engage. Mm. <laughs> but I'm not doing that. Phone off. Smart. I'm not talking after seven. I'm in the mix. The fresh. Because swimming right. classes start at 730. <laughs> this is why I told me. To that's, a, that that's a brave flyer. time to do that. Yeah. Yeah. Well, Don't no, because then there's still pool is going to be packed. <laughs> when I, now you see where I'm going with this. I'm, I'm going to feel real good when I get this light, lighty light set up going. <laughs> so I switched it up. I will not pay the 20 grand for lights. Smart. Okay. Pay 15 instead. 20 grand for lights 
for them to drill up the grass and insert electricity in a house that you don't own. It's just that's crazy. It doesn't make sense <laughs> for, for one month no, left for, of pool no, time. For one, for one day. party. For one day. <laughs> for, for one day. Yeah. Now you leave it in for next year. So two parties. Okay. <laughs> um. Yeah. No. I'm gonna go with the battery operated uh Xterus. I like it. Nice. It'll oh, get the no, job no, done. No. 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 That's gonna, that's gonna be much better than the other lights. Yeah. Okay. The Xterus could have got some solar power joints to really. You know what I mean? Not to worry about no, batteries. No, solar power. <laughs> Joe should go green. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, guys. 2019. Yeah, if you want the hipster Brooklyn chicks there. <laughs> Got to be some vegan food there. Well, I don't want to see anything plugged in. Everything has to be from the sun. <laughs> from the solar system? It should, it should be fresh water, no chlorine. <laughs> True. It's a good don't point. need chlorine in that no, water. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely want to I'm bringing my chlorine tablets. Put the thing in there that tells if someone peed in it. Yeah. I'm bringing the chlorine or, tablets. Never mind. Don't worry. Pop going to be at the spade table selling the sex pills. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, I'm, 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 I'm copping. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is y'all looking at? <laughs> Yo, Yo, did you ever use the pill? <laughs> we're we're Why on air. Tell me? <laughs> we're on air. <laughs> Oh, it's a secret. Oh, okay. I let them know when I'm about to bust them down. Like, <laughs> <laughs> wait, I'm weird. No, Y'all are crazy. No, wait, wait, chick, know that ain't my normal dick. She ain't got to know that. <laughs> she, she knows. <laughs> no, you're right. She's aware. She don't have to know. But well, she knows. She knows. Yeah. It's like, damn, daddy, what you doing on a Tuesday? Yeah. Nah, I bust one down. <laughs> <laughs> bust, you know what I mean? Don't even worry about it. I had a trick for you. I took one of them things. Yeah. Nah, that little gray shit. <laughs> <laughs> that shit was like this big. Nah, but you got to chop it in half. I uh, know. I mean, it? I hope, you, you from what a, I heard. You took a third. Oh, <laughs> Roy took a third. Roy took, he was scared of it. I know he was. Smart. You took a third. Tell Drew. We're on air. I don't know what you're talking about. All right, forget it, man. <laughs> Jlad. I took a third the first time. Now Jlad. I'm halfing him down. I'm halfing him down. Y'all look crazy. That shit don't get your headaches. <laughs> It gives her a headache. <laughs> Mom been taking them gas station joints. Yeah. So been doing no, I don't. Hell no. Ezo. What, what's the name of this? Easy. Took, what's the name of the Easy? No, it's easy, it's yeah, easy something. You got yeah. Easy something right. from the gas station. Well, you nasty. That's Hell. Years ago. And from a fucking, uh, from a Riverside gas station. I never took none of that shit from the gas station. I took a, I took a Viagra one time she years gonna, ago. Half gonna, of one. No, no. They that shit gave they, me a super they, headache. No, that, you, that used to do that. They improved. I don't fuck with that. They though. improved on it by then. She oh. getting a headache. Head, yeah. head all on the head. other Reggie. <laughs> yeah. My bad. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not so deep into this field. Diff, diff, into this world. Different, different nigga on the on the half ends. <laughs> Syllable strokes. I told you. <laughs> I don't want this lifestyle. For you. <laughs> I promise I want better for you. Are you inviting Ma, people? I'm gonna say that until you use one. I'm scared of him because that one that experience, the headache was crazy. Papa don't, walk you through it. This nigga's scared of a headache, man. Yeah, now nah, that headache is <laughs> crazy. Do, do me a favor. Yeah. Don't, don't come by the state. Tell me. <laughs> no, don't cool. worry about it. I ain't fucking with that more, shit. more for us. <laughs> uh, anywho, uh, off of the pool party, let's go to our hipster chick, Rock Nation insider, Ralad Pharrell, to tell us about why Rihanna unfollowed title. Ooh. <laughs> And followed Spotify. Ooh. I'm also on Spotify as well. Ooh. <laughs> huh? Uh, a, a deal, <laughs> obviously. <laughs> I don't tell you, it's not that hard to see that. You set, you set your man up to be great. <laughs> he just kills it all. All right, what kind of deal, Rory? Because this, this, the breaking of this news got fans excited. And I read it and said, ooh, this Spotify Fenty is going to be crazy out there. <laughs> Y'all still think she, she is. She's giving you niggas blue balls, just teasing music that's never coming. Spotify has their own shade of Fenty coming, and that's what this is about. Spotify green? That's, just come on, Maul. Yeah, okay. Creators got to create. No, they right. can't even help it. You're going to scan your QR code at Sephora while you buy your Fenty to listen to Spotify for free. Oh, come on. <laughs> Mm. You know it's coming. I see how it's tied in. I see it. I see how it's tied in. I get it. No, that did make me think music was coming though. <laughs> Listen, music better be coming. <laughs> it's coming. She's not doing that for we, a reason. We've been saying that for a long time. 
She yeah, but when you unfollow this. something that you had a stake in and then go to the other brand. That's, that's she's, the, she's giving us studio videos that's on the, Instagram. That's the only thing I hate about news today. Like, we have to pull so much from a follow or unfollow. Yeah, it's sick. <laughs> like, we know nothing about nothing, so we're just guessing based off shit. Exactly. Uh, it's fun. <laughs> React. Guess is for it. <laughs> yeah, I look forward to it. Whatever it is. Album, Fenty. I'm getting it. <laughs> Um, all right, what else is shade? happening? What else what's is your, happening? What's your Fenty number? I don't even know, Rory. All of us are not blessed to know our uh, Fenty number. J-Lo is playing Griselda. No mall. She's not joining Westside and Conway and Benny. She's actually in a movie. Oh, and she's she, playing the Griselda. The Griselda, yes. Mm -hmm. I don't know when oh. this movie's coming out. I have no information. Oh, I, I just read the headline. Here, Rory. Look how you freaked that. Yeah. <laughs> she's playing Rory the Griselda. trying to freak the segues now. <laughs> <laughs> I don't mix it up. Uh, okay, well, good for her. I think that'd be dope. She's playing Griselda, though? Yes. Okay. How do you feel about that, Bo? Yeah, I'm interested, interested, interest, interested to see it. I don't mean... that, Which doesn't tell us how you feel about it. <laughs> I'm interested to see it. Do you think she'll nail it? Have you ball? ever seen a picture of, of Griselda? Yes. So how do you feel about J-Lo playing Griselda? Uh, I think By it looks. Been, I think it would have been better if they got uh, the lady that play the lady that killed Selena in the movie with J-Lo I think she looks more like 25 years ago Griselda Blanco <laughs> and uh then J-Lo does I think that would you know why do we try to put him in positions to win <laughs> I mean she got busy in enough so <laughs> J-Lo got her ass kicked that whole movie to the end that's all that matters <laughs> well that's when she had enough yeah she had enough all of a sudden two hours later homeboy forgot how to fight <laughs> like, no, she just learned how to fight. He was still trying to hit her with the regular guys. woman beating moves. Guys. <laughs> My bad, Savon. Wait, is he writing? We talking about a movie, man. Oh, come on. <laughs> Gotta flag it. We're talking about a movie. He stopped fighting back. He wasn't wearing a wife beater either. He had a suit on, actually. <laughs> He had a full suit on when a he tank got top, Rory. <laughs> They're called tank tops. They're called tank tops. <laughs> he wasn't in his cotton tank. <laughs> cotton tank. Yeah. Hey, yo, niggas say J Lo can't act, but I was watching that enough movie like, damn, she got up again. <laughs> <laughs> she got up. She <laughs> he is fucking beating the shit out of her. And she just keeps fighting back. Yeah. Enough. Perseverance. Yeah. Gotta they spend some shit. Or stupidity. <laughs> All right. Too far. All right. Or stupidity. <laughs> Rewind. Didn't she win her father back with like a necklace <laughs> that oh, she slammed God. on a table? We go. See? The father was like, yo, get out of my face. I'm not giving you money. <laughs> She's like, remember this. <laughs> and then was a millionaire in like five minutes. <laughs> Yo, the funny shit was, I don't remember, but J-Lo might have trained for two days and enough. <laughs> she was trained by Seal, I think. <laughs> she didn't even look like Seal. It wasn't. Bro. You could have gave her some vocal lessons. It wasn't All Seal. Right. <laughs> Yo, A-Rod I mean, is going to kill you. <laughs> oh, sh oh, fuck. I forgot. <laughs> it wasn't Seal. <laughs> Did he look like Seal? No. Did he play Seal in the Griselda all, movie? We don't all look alike, Rory. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, don't do that. I don't think Rory thinks I look like Seal. <laughs> That's not true. I know racism exists. You guys are both bold. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> See? Um, yeah, man. Black Thought's breath control. <laughs> <laughs> well, Top five. Well, <laughs> and not five. <laughs> Not five. Dan, you guys have Capital One? <laughs> Drake is so spicy. <laughs> Top two and God not two. two. <laughs> <laughs> you like that ball when you heard it, though. I know you Yeah, did. but yo. I know you yo, but yeah, yo, I know we love Drake, but come on. I'm Top it's two and not it's, two. It's that, a popular ball. That, that's a yeah. that's a nice that's spicy a, that took bar. Instagram by storm. It did top two because top two. two alone is dope. You ain't got to say that's nothing. That's saying now. a lot. But now I'm gonna tell you, <laughs> I'm not Just to two. be clear, <laughs> and not two, <laughs> <laughs> which would only leave but one spot. Right. <laughs> you do the math. <laughs> 
Y'all I'm just gonna let that man. bar simmer. <laughs> <laughs> let y'all think on that one. <laughs> oh, 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 I, I, I hate when Joe get into this mode, bro. <laughs> this nigga's stupid, man. What's wrong with you? Yo, that is a spicy bar, though. Very that nigga's ill, man. Very spicy. <laughs> Yo, if Joe Button could have had spicy bars in his career, ooh. ooh. <laughs> no, you had, you had a few spicy You had bars. some spicy ones. No? I don't think so. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, give me chicks. Give me OLS. Yeah. Nothing in there was spicy. Oh shit! That was Cajun. <laughs> that was black and, and not even like the Popeyes <laughs> joint, like the yeah, real, no, the real like from yeah, Louisiana. Black and Cajun. Yeah. What are you talking about? What was? What was spicy? Maybe I'm all off. eight minutes of each one of them. <laughs> you was at Hotel His House. <laughs> What are you talking uh, about? Uh, I've never seen that hotel I've before. Ne- yo, I'm, I go on <laughs> hotel tonight at? all the time. Those are in Miami? His I, house has never popped I up. I go on <laughs> hotel tonight. You're such a white ass. <laughs> I go on hotel tonight. Fine. Ho- hotel, his house was, was yeah. <laughs> yeah. I know. I know. But that's spicy? Yes. Yes. You had a lot you of spicy. You hotel, Ubu? his house. I don't think that's spicy. Whoa, Ubu? <laughs> yeah, you named every hotel, service house available to the internet. Uh, won't Skype, Gmail, chat, and won't Uvu. That's so, spicy. That's a lot of options. <laughs> yeah, bitch didn't And he had bad <laughs> The fuck y'all talking about? That ain't spicy. That was like... anger and hurt. <laughs> niggas talking there was about a, spice. There was a running that, back that bar in spice, there. though. Anger and hurt built spice. I, what y'all saying is like bitterness and resentment. That's I don't, spice. I don't, I don't, I, nah, spice is, I don't, I don't even have to give this to you. Like, but you getting it. When uh, you hurt and you angry, you got to give it to somebody. But spice is like spice. I don't have to give this to you, and this is petty, but here, nigga, <laughs> not too. <laughs> like, yeah, I could have let you answer this on your own. Yeah, I'm gonna do the math for you. I, you having trouble? Yeah, I got you. <laughs> Why are you thinking still? <laughs> not too. <laughs> what are you pondering? <laughs> you know, Drake asked. What are you pondering? <laughs> no, not too future. <laughs> I get it was like a Jamaican double entendre upon pondering. I see what you did. I'm getting You're my Drake that. interview, so y'all better shut up. <laughs> Spotify, y'all better pay Drake for my interview. <laughs> uh, all right, well, now we got to go to Pandora to do that now. That's true. Got to go up to Sirius. He's going to interview you. Oh shit! He's gonna. <laughs> You're gonna pull up on him. <laughs> Just tell you what it is, bro. <laughs> the landscape yes. has changed. Yeah, he's gonna state the culture. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> thank you both. The, the, thank you for telling me the landscape parks, and thank you for telling me that he's gonna state the culture, Rory. Okay. I said you was the culture, though. See. Thank you, Rory. All right, bro, let's, let me do it. Let me leave. <laughs> <laughs> so, well, so do you guys have Capital One Bank? No, no. And if I yeah, did, if actually, I, if I did, I wouldn't tell a million people. <laughs> they have your social. Why now. they have it? Uh, yeah. You wouldn't want to tell them. They got hey, hiding. if you have parks, this shit. <laughs> yeah, no. I got the email. I think I got your social in here somewhere. Oh, okay, nice. I told my. I asked my mom today. Did you check our Capital One shit to see if we were uh, hacked and our information? That reason that oh, what happened? <laughs> yeah, right, no. They got you. Never, never mind. You don't even know what happened. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> never mind. Then you started thinking about what account it was. Fuck. <laughs> no, that's the that's the account I just keep with enough money for like my parents. <laughs> it's not a lot. Because <laughs> 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 that's why we'll only give your parents the bare minimum. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's not true. That's not true. Don't do that. Don't do that. I have, fuck with you. I have seventeen years of doing it, but then I got the bag. You bought your dad a truck. Damn, Rory. You said it on here. <laughs> I did. Yeah, you did. We congratulated oh. you. All right, cool. Yeah. <laughs> it's funny when you buy your parents some shit and they complain. That's how like, it goes. Like, like my pop goes, listen, I'm done paying this much for Geico. <laughs> pop, pop, you don't pay anything. <laughs> you know, that's me. I didn't even know. What is it now that you've been? To- <laughs> Yo, my parents have had enough of paying too much for some shit that they're not they're paying, not paying for, for it all. Old parents. Is that, all right. I thought that was old, old parents. parents. All right. Got it. Got it. Got it. No, it's all of them. <laughs> Definitely all of them. Well, yeah, this shout is out way to too expensive. You don't pay for you not paying. It's like, yeah, Jesus. <laughs> I could have did something else with that. Word, and they ain't even seen the expensive shit yet. We ain't even started looking at homes, <laughs> like nah. the old folks' homes. Everything broke in my mom's house when that <laughs> when that Spotify press release came out. Everything in my my mom's house broke. <laughs> 
Yeah, that's out of what, nowhere. That's what my mom said. Oh, I have no hot water. Too, too, dang, mom, too mom, dangerous I, to live here. I just washed my hands. <laughs> it was very hot. You've been living here. You've been, you've Everybody lived knows here you. For 35 years, you're a staple, you're a pillar of the community. <laughs> and it's gentrified now. Yeah. You're, you're mad. It's, it's mad the, safe. the safest you've ever been. Every day, my Joey, I don't know. I don't know about this one here. <laughs> Miss Faye, that's Joe joking. I would never joke. Yeah, it's true. She's going to fuck me up. I'm sorry. Kidding. <laughs> Kidding. Uh, all look, right. I look at the spot on her block. Now, listen, all nice. rappers don't maintain that type of breath control. <laughs> <laughs> Black thought. In a class of his own. Lupe. <laughs> class of his own. <laughs> Lupe is in that class. I don't he know. Is. Y'all be joking. Okay. Okay. Um, oh, wait, speaking of uh, parents and sons, Corey uh, just keeps killing me. I'm, I am game. so <laughs> two sick. hours in. How does he do it? <laughs> I am so sick of seeing LeBron James support his son in basketball. <laughs> they had the internet outraged. I am. It is disgusting <laughs> that you would want to make all the kids on his AU team's dreams come true by doing a layup line with the greatest NBA player on the court right now. How fucking dare you, LeBron James? It's All true. right. I'm, I'm with yeah. you on that. Yeah. I'm with you. The gall. He should have just sat down. He's just trying to be famous. Yeah. <laughs> He's clout chasing. Damn, that was a real take on a real TV network. <laughs> wow. He's clout chasing. No, I tell you, LeBron no, he, James these, these guys, just wants to be famous. These guys, when the, all the sports are down, oh, they, they, they be bro. struggling for it. I keep ESPN on basically all day, every day. It's a struggle during these summer it's, months. It's tough. It and is. I don't know Steve how. Steve Smith don't even show up anymore. He's old. Yeah, no, he'd be chilling. He's like, yo, call me when there's a sport. <laughs> don't make me just come in here to Baseball doesn't count. hyperbolize. Shit, was it the Kawhi thing? What was it when he was on vacation? He had to get on his phone. Like, oh, shit, I guess something real happened. <laughs> Fuck, I had his vacation hat on. He had a silk shirt on. Yo, don't yeah, tell, me, about, Paul don't tell shit. me who got signed weird with a silk shirt on. Yeah, he, Steve, Stephen A. had a silk shirt with a gold chain on. That's funny. My PG went, where? <laughs> this is blasphemy. <laughs> Somebody put out an article saying that I said Zion Williamson is trash. Like, I saw that picking up steam. And I probably did, but as a Nick fan, it's not, like, real. <laughs> It was like a hatred, a anger. Every Nick fan Hurt. called Jordan trash. True. Yeah. I call everybody trash that y'all don't get. <laughs> That's just a Nick thing, though. I think players know that. So we, no, we think the whole league no, is trash. The Knicks <laughs> called Jordan trash. <laughs> yeah, they did. We yeah. called them trash. They did. Yeah. All right. The Jordan is trash. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, oh. A little overrated, if you ask me. Oh, yeah. I feel you. I see why you say that. Oh, man. After the Starks dunk. Yeah, <laughs> they love the Nick fans. Love oh, to hold on to that one. The Starks dunk. Yeah, yeah, then, yeah. Then, then what happened after that? Shh, doesn't matter. <laughs> I don't know. I didn't see it. <laughs> <laughs> Maul, are you all for the Clippers changing their name? I know we're not on sports. I just want to ask you. Wait, they're changing their name. I would have yeah. to see what they go with. I would have to see what they go with. I saw. They, they definitely, need, they definitely need, need a new mascot. They should that move mascot back to they have is scary. Need what? They should move back to Buffalo. All right, we're not giving no, that no, mascot no. deep dives and no parks. I'm all for <laughs> name change though. If it's a if it's a cool name, I'm all for it. Rory save us from them. Uh, <laughs> Drake and LeBron are taking what's it called, Maul? You're part of the company. Oh, Un- uninterrupted. Oh, okay. Uh, Drake is now a partner for Canada and uh, uninterrupted, and they're gonna be covering Canadian sports. Maybe sitting some barber chairs up in the six. Ahoy, matey. The, what was that? The what? Canadian accent. Wait, what was that? That's <laughs> not. I don't, Canadians don't say that. Uh, no Canadian Wait, has ever. Are there pirates in time. Canada? No Canadian has ever said that. <laughs> Mad like, pirates on Lake Michigan? Yeah, literally no. <laughs> literally no Canadian has ever spoken like well, that. Well, how does men know? <laughs> Does man's know? Ahoy, mate. <laughs> this nigga just yelled ahoy, mate. But does man's know? <laughs> man's know. Man, man's knows. Man's that. knows that t- oh, Canadians don't speak all like all that. All right, I'll take your word. <laughs> ahoy, mate. You've never seen a Canadian pirate, though. That's how you know. <laughs> that is true. That, never seen a Canadian my point. pirate. Y'all have to start speaking in things. But I don't think a Canadian based. pirate we wouldn't would, have a would podcast. Like ahoy, mate. Ahoy, ting. Ahoy, man. Ahoy, ahoy, man. Ahoy, ting. Ahoy mans Ahoy mans It's a cruise ship ting (laughs) This is not a cruise ship ting (laughs) Who's headed to the (laughs) 6th 
<laughs> I'm never gonna get my interview. I'm never getting my interview. That's hilarious. Ever, ever. And I just want my interview. <laughs> Ahoy, man. <laughs> <laughs> OVO the gang. <laughs> no, 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 let me stop. <laughs> Make push a T E walk the plank. <laughs> <laughs> Who'd really think they blem? <laughs> Who blem for real? <laughs> I never really caught on, did you? I love that song. Me too. It's a great song. That's all that's one of the songs I'm sure Drake was surprised. Hey, that didn't catch you. Yeah. <laughs> No one's using he, he that looked, word. He looked back at that one like, hey. You know he thought it was going to catch because he put his I little Virginia too. Black shit in there. He thought that was the one. And I did too. <laughs> yeah, I did too. That's a good record. Maybe because we didn't know what the fuck Blim meant. <laughs> so why does that I, ever matter? I use context for, clues. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, I could tell you the nights I was Blim. <laughs> <laughs> you know what Blim is. You know. You've been Blim. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she know what Blim is too. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> Definitely, or <laughs> she know what blim is. And blemishes. if you don't know what blim is, I can just make up mad definitions right now. Nah, you know what blim is. I can make something up for when she know what it is. <laughs> <laughs> it's the goo. Oh, don't ever say goo and look at me. <laughs> Yo, I don't know why I, st- I talk to this goo. It's the goo. It's the goo. I'm talking about he, bl- he blemmed all over her face. <laughs> Mm-mm-mm. So Drake and Chris Brown are teasing a project. <laughs> Yo, Rory. Yo, get it off, Rory. Get it off. Go ahead. Go ahead, man. Because I don't even know this story, but get it off. You've been trying since the top. <laughs> I could have sworn that that picture was after the video and said it's coming soon. Did they tease a project? Tell me if we're honest. It was a picture I mean, I from, the, the from the video shoot, video shoot. But I thought the video had been over. So why? So where's the tease? Coming the tease. soon. Yeah. No, I don't think that picture was... I think that picture was... It was it was before the video. Oh, everyone's talking like that shit was after. No, no, it was before the video. It, it might have been the day before, actually. Yeah. Oh, great! It says something is coming. Then the video well, came the day after. I, I was blem, so yeah, you were blem. <laughs> Don't worry about it. All right, I got you. Anyone care about the Kodak freestyle? Nope. You do. You know you love the niggas rapping from jail. <laughs> Gotta find a live part two. Soon, soon as I hear yeah, Kodak soon as I, Black, soon as I saw Kodak rap from jail, I said, "Oh man, man, Rory got shine part two mm-hmm. I know he's home hitting his head on the wall to this one. <laughs> <laughs> he and he and I was like, "This one's gonna be around for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> this one's gonna stick." Yeah, yeah. Don't act like you ain't like Capone from jail on CNN. Oh come on, that's different. Come on, yeah, come on. Yeah, that's that's not even the same. Yeah, see, set y'all up. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't care about this freestyle. I thought it was horrible. Forget all that. And let's move on. I do think that Kodak can rap, but just he can. Too. He no. actually can. I, I, yeah, he can rap. Probably he should be saying about, a lot of. That's yeah. what that's what puzzles that, me about Kodak. Yes, thank you. He thank says you. a lot of shit in you his know. rhymes, and I'm like, that says he this, gets it. This kid is smart, right? Because he says a lot of slick shit, and I'm like, but then why does his actions say he's not so smart? Because I'm a Jesus P. <laughs> like I, that's my shit. I, I didn't just, know I, the pee. I don't get it. <laughs> no, it was a, a valid. You hey, don't you be- want to pee? You don't believe in Jesus? <laughs> that's, that's Why it. do you have a Jesus piece? I keep asking him all that, and he won't answer me. <laughs> Every <laughs> week I ask him all. Who said I don't believe in Jesus? Kodak <laughs> <laughs> from prison. <laughs> Never had a conversation with that kid. I'm telling you what he said though. He wasn't talking to me. Oh, all right. I ain't believing these. They got GB. Yo, the pirates, the South, <laughs> everyone's gonna fuck Joe up. Word. He gonna be a pirate. He gonna have to live on the ship when niggas is looking for him. I am a pirate. Are you? No, nigga. No. Oh. <laughs> I don't know what you do. I, I can't swim. I'm gonna be a pirate. I've never seen a pirate in water. Now that I think about sure it. Sure, you did. Pirates of the Caribbean. They were dead, weren't they? <laughs> well, yeah, look, white. They couldn't swim. They? White, people, white, white people stole the water from the dead niggas. <laughs> White people go take from, <laughs> take from anybody. I'm telling you, man. White people will take from anybody. <laughs> yeah, they don't even need. Why they eat me? All right. You know, somehow that song came on with me and Rory's in the club, and I'm like, damn, his rap voice is ill. <laughs> like, I'm telling you how I'm conditioned now. They fully tricked me. <laughs> That's what you're listening for, the ill rap voice? I'm always listening for ill rap voice. That's always been the that's thing helpful. Rap, that's super helpful. Yeah. Like, that's always been a thing. Like, the, yeah. If you had a very distinct voice, that was helpful. Any <clears throat> beat. <laughs> that's that's distinct. <laughs> that's that part. Yeah. 
Okay. Somebody did that. Did this. <laughs> Some- <laughs> Somebody. Hey, he had a point. Uh, yeah, so I don't care about that. Rory, you want to give us an in jail album freestyle breakdown? Uh, well, was he dating this young woman? I, I don't. Savon, what's her name? That's she's pregnant now. Oh, he cool. said in the freestyle that he was going to punch her in the stomach. Oh come on, come on, come on! Like, come on. Yeah, it was. It was. Yeah, that's. I didn't want to. Please, 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 please. Yeah, yeah, it was it was enough. horrible. I, enough, enough of that. That's I'm why I said forget it. Let's that. move on. Let's talk about the Epstein the, the Epstein dude being found in his cell in the fetal position. Good. All right. <laughs> he tried to take himself out, right? Oh, is that what it was? That's what I they said. They said it looked like he tried to commit suicide. Uh, I'm, I'm Which how would you know that if the, the dude is on the, in the fetal position in jail? On the yeah, floor? like what if he had a stomach ache? Like, <laughs> he tried to I'm kill yeah, himself. Yeah, no one yeah, yeah, You guys yeah, ever got yeah. food poisoning? Yeah, You're right. in the fetal position. Stomach is a knot. <laughs> uh, well, I'm happy to inform you guys. I know uh, you guys had a, a rough week after everything that happened with Sway Lee and his girlfriend. But uh, yeah, Rory's on the pulse of this one. <laughs> everyone, uh, well, I'm the Sway Lee relationship insider for the past three and a half years. That's true. That's true. Everyone, Thank you for your everyone, service, in, by including uh, the Simmon family, everyone came together and rose above this and apologized, and then later on posted more. <laughs> tweets of not replying to each other and saying yo that's my ex and then him saying it's not my ex so i'm just going to keep you guys up to date i don't know where this one is going yet but i can say if we're going off history they may end up back together <laughs> god willing <laughs> yeah she fall for anything yo my haircut was different in that picture he said yo i don't even have a grill <laughs> this way <laughs> this way you have a grill you have a grill I don't even have dr- you have all those things <laughs> you have everything you're saying you don't have right now and I'm talking shit just for uh, shits and giggles I don't know anything about any of that that's uh, that, that's the young people news I stay away from no one's paying attention to that shit but me because I think it's hilarious that people are still <laughs> reporting on every other week they break up and get back together and Shade Room continues to inform us and tell us hey new couple alert <laughs> <laughs> new old couple relationship goals <laughs> Word. Look at them at Target together. Remember, chicks would say relationship goals to like no, a couple holding Shorty hands. Shorty keeps screenshotting everything and sending it back to the shade room for confirmation. And then he'll be like, yo, nah, shade room. Here's another screenshot. But not together. <sighs> Anyways. I'll keep relationship you guys up to goals. I want to walk through the airport and hold hands. I want to go out to dinner. <laughs> well, that's kind of a goal, the though. Movies. I, that wanna, was, I, I definitely wanna, see the movies I want to eat something goal. <laughs> Relationship goals I want to see a film <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I want to be on the same Like planet as this person <laughs> yeah, Goals Relationship goals people. So Fuck out of here Yeah man Anyway Alright I don't have much left uh, I don't know if you guys saw the trailer For the No one saw a thing doc But I thought it was really interesting uh, It's some I, I think some Missouri town Possibly save on If you look that up Where A murder happened In front of the entire town And then they came to Investigate it and everyone in the town no said, oh. said, nah, <laughs> we ain't see shit. All right. And now they're all still in this dock saying, nah, we saw all that shit, but we didn't see shit. <laughs> this dock is coming out where? <laughs> on Netflix. Oh, all right, Netflix. It should look great. Sound like y'all starting to put anything on y'all platform. <laughs> <laughs> Except Monique, right? <laughs> Joe. All right. We got sleep for <laughs> I just try to come do an honest podcast. Except for Monique. Monique. Monique gonna kick your ass. Why? I fuck with Monique. No, nah, y'all know. She fuck with you too. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, let me just make sure there's no story that we're missing. Because I can tell when Rory just want to go home. Okay. I'm the only one talking and bringing topics up. What are you talking about? I know, because I want to go home. <laughs> <laughs> uh... Rory used to snitch on his classmates in school, I could tell. Yeah, right. <laughs> now nah, Rory was the one getting snitched on. For sure. Word. Uh, this was a good podcast, gentlemen. Easy, fun. easy breezy. Uh, muscle memory like clockwork. Uh, something like Light Wednesday gave it to him. <laughs> Maul and I were having a conversation about uh about some of the flattery that we see out there. From some other outlets. What does flattery mean? Same thing Seinfeld said at the beginning of that, uh, beginning of his cars, comedians, and coffee thing about how since the last time they were here, they see a lot of people that 
She's imitating certain things from the oh, show, okay. and it's, gotcha. it's flattery. And imitation is the greatest form of flattery. Flattering, I see. Yeah, I, I see the root word now. They, these niggas just they, just, they do just couches and high stools. <laughs> like, they ain't even trying <laughs> they, to, they like... They stole my living room? Yes. 100% <laughs> like, your living room's a hit. <laughs> yeah, how I copyright my, my living room? 100%. Uh, I'm sure Brian's figuring out a way. Uh... Is there anything happening this weekend or anything coming up that we should be aware of? Well, we'll be right back this weekend, so we'll be able to talk about it Saturday. Anything happening before then that we should be aware of? Democratic debate. Well, it's tonight. It's probably right now. It's yesterday. No, it's yesterday. Yeah. Yeah. So. And is this where they split it up or is everyone on the same? I think they split it up. Okay. So Uh, there'll probably be another one. Yeah. AOC was on uh, Rosenberg and them this morning, too. Oh, yeah. Good interview. Um, I also want to say I want to backtrack from last podcast when I said that uh, Kiss probably got the Pharrell bag from uh, uh, Fab. It was the same time. It was the same time. I think the locks had it before him, but whatever. Well, they did, but I ain't counting if you get jiggy with it with knock yourself out. It's two different styles, two different runs, I guess. But you can't say you got it from someone when you already had the record. Okay. Yeah. Um, glad we didn't come argue games Discog versus 50s Discog Because we all agree that That's games Game got that right? Yeah We all yeah. yeah If we're talking just solo albums Yes Yeah maybe not as game. big of an album As Get Rich or Die Tribe Definitely but not No of course not Well I mean, shit, I documentary, documentary was yeah, it's, it's, it wasn't right, it's as, right there. But it definitely no, was not, not as big as Kim no, Shadai yeah. trying. No, it's not. It's numbers not. wise, impact wise, everything wise. No. Yeah. Single wise, yeah. Yeah. Well, everything wise. But a great album. It's a good. A classic. It's, it's a, I right. think the documentary is a classic. It's a good Get Rich B. <laughs> yeah. Okay. It's yeah. like a great, yeah, that's what it is to me. Um. All right, so that's about it for now. Listen, thank you all for being here with us. You could have been anywhere in the world. But you hear not always us. true. <laughs> some people can't. That's white privilege. <laughs> they have to be like, work. Everyone that can't be anywhere in the world. Yeah, they're right where they can be. <laughs> <laughs> some niggas. Well, well, some what's niggas, wrong with them? Honestly. Some niggas no, but some niggas is really right where they can be. <laughs> like they want to be somewhere else, they just can't be. But yeah. it says could have. You could have been no, anywhere. No, they could. Some <laughs> niggas can't be anywhere other than where they at. Yeah, that's true. There's a few niggas that are trying to be at the pool bar. You can't. You can't. Could have. Could have not been there. Ain't no could have about that one. No. <laughs> Just stay see, home. See now you understand. <laughs> Listen, man. Until the next time, I bid you adieu. Farewell. Arrivederci. Hasta la vista. Adios. So long. Goodbye. One. Deuces. Uh, remember, life is a series of moments, and moments pass. So let's make each one. Let's make each one last, as if it's all that we have. Remember, the girl is not cute. She's young. She's not thick. She's on her tippy toes. She doesn't have hips. She's sitting on the sink. She's not living her best life. She's uh <laughs> miserable. <laughs> <laughs> what did we say she I was? Yeah. Oh, you wasn't. She's not living her. What is she doing, man? She's uh self medicating. Yeah. Oh my no, more god! Bar. Yeah. I just forgot what the bar yeah, was. Yeah, no, she's she, she's escaping reality. <laughs> self medicating to to avoid. Having to tell us what's really going on, and we're all just watching and cheering yeah. her on, saying, "Let's go, sis!" Cheering on her demise. <laughs> go, sis! She's not protecting her peace. She's avoiding accountability and <laughs> fail, failing to realize how her how her actions have a direct effect on the negative happenings in her life as well as others. <laughs> uh, yeah, universe is not fixing that, ma. <laughs> Bitches love blaming the universe. No, yeah, bitch. sometimes it ain't the universe. <laughs> no. Mercury had you. nothing to do with yeah, this. Nah, Retrograde nah. had nothing to nah, do with that. That was your ass yeah. Yeah. and nothing else. Yeah. yeah. Mercury yeah. did not send that text. Yeah, you just drank too and much. Mercury was way over there. Yeah, for real. The Mercury is letting them see a sun. <laughs> All right. How, I don't know why y'all out every time I say that. <laughs> because y'all don't have kids. That's why. All right, fine. Uh, until next time, we will talk to you guys later. Have a blast. And we're out of here. Bye! Oh, let me turn it up, man. It's not as aggressive when you do that. No, 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 no,